Oh. Hello, welcome to the first game of the semifinals, the Root Winter Tournament, everyone. Uh, we have some wonderful players here. We have Waterman121, say hello. Hello, everybody. We have Marcus the Cat. Hello. We have Confettis. Hello. And then we have Shoe Crown. <clears throat> hello, Root Community. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and let you guys get started, and good luck. They're really good. Awesome. Right. Thank you. you a, good luck, everyone. Good, good luck, guys. <laughs> then, of course, stream. You also have. Let's do it. You also have myself and BotBot -Bot commentating. BotBot, -Bot, say hello. Hello. Can you hear me? They can hear you. He's talking now, Lily. No way. Let's see. What's their pool look like? Cats, moles, eerie, river folk, lizards. And they're using mountain. Ooh. Wow, no Vagabond. How about that? I hate the <laughs> Mountain map. Ooh. Marcus did want to play cats. <laughs> I'm mad that oh, geez, this is that. scary. Oh, I'll, yeah. I'll do this. Why not? What about, like, That is, like, the perfect faction mix for the mountain map. I don't like talking. It's just got danger, conflict. Death and destruction all over it. Yeah, I'm really curious to see where this goes. First pick on mountain man. <laughs> and with with all of the mountain cat wins that we've seen in this tournament, I I expect to see some heat on the cats. Yeah. In this game. Yeah. They were just talking about it before we started. It's not a bad choice. Yeah. Do you like tahini? I like tortilla chips and salsa. Alright, let's do it. Really? Yeah, did I tell you about just high on the salsa? No. Like, he came to my class virtually once, he was like, sorry, Mr. Lewis, I was eating Yeah, salsa. I'm gonna go I with that. Uh, chips and salsa. Ooh, river folk. River folk. Yeah. What's this map look like? Uh, oh, we got a little bunny corner over here. That could be useful for lizards. Ooh. You're so mean. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I left him you picked moles and you had a few rabbits in your hand. That wouldn't even be a bad start either. Yeah, just yeah. Keep, just keep going. And if lizards didn't make it into the game, oh look at that! You can pick moles and keep lizards out of the game. Look at that! Now moles can just go total swole mole and just race to the finish. Although otters are a bit of a problem. If you were to take that corner, and now you've got the otters being able to just come in here. I, I don't know. Corner. This is going to be a, a busy map. Three coin factions, yeah. and we have the river folk. River folk might just get pushed off the map. Well, I know that if the river folk came out to a strong start, that's going to just destroy their chances of winning. It's really how well can the river folk manage their point. Yeah. The point gain. Pacing I is going to be huge that's for them. the biggest thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Waterman. So is there any reason is there any reason to talk about what's happened up to this point in the tournament or is everybody watching already already tuned in already know like this is nothing new for that group or uh, I think it's worth talking about at least a little bit. <laughs> It's been interesting how each each round has had its own sort of narrative like yeah. with the coalitions that we've had so much controversy around the coalitions and we've some of the interesting cat wins so much cat wins yeah. mm -hmm. it was i think it was round two or three where cats came from behind where they'd won like very few games up to that point and then all of a sudden they won a ton of games was it round one? Really? That doesn't sound right. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. There's been too many games. It's hard to keep track of rounds and everything. Uh, let's get well, cats have won. Stuff. Cats have won uh, six of the twenty-one games that they've been in. Am I allowed to um, show my cards in the market at this point? Uh, um. Yes, uh, that should be so, part of your setup, I think. All right. 
I will say um, one thing that hasn't been 100% clear in our draft is specifically when certain things should happen, such as with an alliance when they take their supporters, when the river folk uh, hand should be turned up. Uh, so I know that there's, there's been resolutions, but it hasn't been 100% clear in the documentation. I will say that. Well, the documentation is really clear for the Wooden Alliance thing because it specifies when you return the cards. It says after setup. It's just nobody reads the the documentation we made. <laughs> sure. Fair enough. The Riverfolk thing, though, that is that's confusing because it's confusing for the base game. I had to ask ask Joshua what this what we're supposed to do okay. for that. Hmm. People cannot read, Lily. Interesting. I'm gonna maybe switching over here. Well, I wasn't really watching. I was kind of looking at the map and okay. everything else. I wasn't really watching who took what. So we've got Marcus with the moles mm -hmm. in first player position. I actually ended up getting left with the moles, which I think is interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. Compettus, Compettus with the birds i don't love waterman and third seat position with cats that's well you got that's rough waterman Especially. is most comfortable with base game factions so for him in the draft it was mostly down to cats and eerie you know three sure i think three yeah i mean there's some good stuff here bird cards and i'd just be really worried about the start he's able to get i mean yeah to put him he in. also picked do that to you guys second right, right? You pick second or third? Yes. Yeah. So he actually had opportunity to take the birds, but I'm took sorry, the cats guys, over that. We'll just have to watch the hand that comes out as we go along. Yeah. Who are Erie starting with? Oh, we have a charismatic start. You think they're going BBC? Moving your other. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Well. I forgot. I I also. I don't want to label it. <laughs> but I mean. I'll tell you what, when I first started playing the birds, I think that incorporating suited cards into your decree was just one of the things that you did all the time. Mm -hmm. It seems like the, it's really transitioned to a no turmoil style. Like that seems to be it's definitely what everybody's trying to do. Right now, and I think it's yeah. probably too dominant. I think there's room for turmoil strats that people are not making room for. Um, Let's see. Back in my day, we used to turmoil all the time. <laughs> oh, I was going to move the dominance board and stuff. I forgot. Oh, yeah. yeah. And. Oh, so it looks like the mod is updated so that everybody's sitting in a corner. Yes. Uh, Mango Feet did a wonderful nice. job updating the script right. so that it would properly do that. Yeah, it's been a while since we've actually given a shout out to Mango Feet for all the amazing work that he's done with the draft scripting. So if you're out there and you've been using the plus one draft tool and you're enjoying it, Mango Feet did it from scratch. An amazing job. Yes, he did. I'm not sure. What do you do with uh, the... Um... So oh, I saw him reveal the Fox Partisans. Um, I missed the other card. The rabbit card, I just swayed oh, with it. Yep. Okay. Yep, I see. I got yeah. it. Okay. And... I guess I should pull up chat. Yes. You should pull up chat. Turn. Let's see what Erie does. All right. Uh, let's all add to my decree. Put a fox card on recruit. And then... Hmm. I'll put a... Um, sorry, question. Uh, yeah. You've got the charismatic leader. I th shouldn't this vizier yeah, should be, on recruit. be on recruit? Yeah, anyway? it should oh, be, on recruit. be on recruit. So yeah, you're that's gonna really wanna, fun. yeah, you're going to want to put that in move, probably. Um, that's fine. Just swap them like that. Oh, yeah. there it goes. Huh. Let's see. Oh, got an early, early rule goof. Let's see. Uh, let's see. I wonder how familiar Competus is with Eerie. Did you want to buy anything before you put that card in? No, no, no. No, it's all good. <laughs> <laughs> We're the semifinals, man. <laughs> you got to find your own way to the finals. <laughs> I'll spend your I'll spend your warriors. I'm not, you know, I'm not going to hold on to them forever. No, yeah, I love I love buying from the shop. Don't get me wrong, but now's not my time. One day. I'll buy it too. I won't buy it three. 
you could you could get uh, one of my bird cards and then put it in your build, and you're just off to a slam and start. <laughs> That's so. Uh... And I'd spend them right away. Thank you, swear. All three. You swear, huh? Mm. I can only spend two right away. You, you, you buy another three. <laughs> Classic and I'll spend all four. <laughs> <laughs> you give me six, I'll give you all six back. Oh. It's tempting, it is. Unfortunately, you can only buy one to start off. Yeah. But next turn, you can get another card. Right. I'll tell you what. I'll, I'll pass on the offer for now, though it was appreciated. Mm. Uh, instead, I'll, I'm going to put a card into... Uh, to build just a bird one. Oh, you didn't um, even need it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I wanted to hear what you had to say. I'm not going to ignore you. And then no, uh, I'll do my decree. I'll recruit there. Um, and then I got to move out of a red. So I'll take uh, these two dudes and then a third and a fourth. And then um, I'll battle cats right here. Go ahead. It's a pretty good roll. Not that he needed it. You want to save it or no? Nope. Right. And then I'll uh, build my roost right there. So, but lean potato, you are right. That is a very common mistake. One point, and then. Uh, I'll draw one card. All right. What's up, everybody? <laughs> Waterman here. <laughs> <laughs> Who's hosting? <laughs> Your game's next week, Waterman. We're commentating this one. <laughs> Um, Riverfolk, how's it going? Oh, yes, I knew you were going to be my best customer. Resist, Waterman, resist. <laughs> look, I got these, I, I picked out these bird cards just for you. And look, there's an ambush. You don't have to use it as an ambush, but you, you know, you could. That's true. You have lots of flexibility. Wow. You know, I do like your cards, but um, I don't think I'm going to get any of those this time unfortunately that's interesting um i am gonna get some nobody's bought though. but yet he passes on the chance to oh cool. mercenaries that makes sense thank you the yeah. point at least the point are we going to bore with the moles or... um i don't know he just wants to build them the... i think so oh. yeah i just want to be able to rule and build and get points and stuff oh, you know all the cat things <laughs> you know that's good with me I, mean, I, I don't think I've ever seen anybody do that on first turn. I, I like it, though. It accomplishes a couple of things. Yeah, it's not common, but... Um, as your first customer, though, I'd, I'd really appreciate you spending those funds back to me. I'll spend them right away. Next turn. Uh, all right. Love that. I promise. Okie dokie. Uh, so, okay, it's Birdsong. Let me grab a wood. Is he going to build? He's definitely going to build. Um, I'm going to go ahead and craft a root tea. Oh, nice. This is already looking like wow, turn one. a mess. And got to be afraid of mountain cats. They are. No, it's the next part strong. of daylight. I'm going to overwork. <laughs> um, I'm going to go ahead and build two times. Uh, sawmill for one point. <clears throat> And a recruiter. There we go. For one point. 
And then I'm going to spend a bird card uh, and recruit. What I also like about this is that he had the opportunity to get a bird card, but he didn't take it. A very lean approach, but I like it. Not feeding the otters any more than necessary. Bird song. Uh, nothing really moving into daylight. Uh, I'm going to spend your two warriors right away because I said I was. And, you know, appreciate the. Oops, sorry, I put them here. Put them That's there. okay. Um, and uh, I'm going to build a trading post. Let's build it right here. So you can always get an extra card for me if you, if you need. Looks like uh, Waterman did forget Everybody, the point for the pass. That due to mercenaries, I actually do rule this. Yeah, you get a point. point for the pass. And he, and, yeah, an even better uh, reason. He's not in the chat, is he? Maybe I should move Mercy. Murder right, Shibut definitely too. DM'd him. Come on, Murder Shibut. How could you? Um, <laughs> I, I'm going to then. Um, Very I sus. Spend two <laughs> of my own guys and put a trading post here. Don't worry, murder. I'm just, I'm just joking around. With the dude, um, that's going to be four points, and then I will spend the other one to draw a card. He used up a lot of his dudes. Let's see what we get? Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Another ambush. Uh, I'll move mercenaries up to three. And weird observation: no uh, one has opened a path. I still think this is a great in round one. Great set of cards. Right now, that is interesting. I'm gonna leave it at that. Oh, and I get a point because I rule. Well, I want to look at, uh, as we go through their turns, I'm going to look at the, these uh, players. That's, that's Hit two is just such a nice round number, you know? Yeah. <clears throat> it means he's I think actually the... To leftover, that leftover fund. <clears throat> but there's a lot of ambushes. I get it. Yeah, I get it as well. I think these cards are three worthy, so I'm going to keep them at that. Maybe. Two ambushes, two fox cards. If you're ever going to get Master Engraver, you want to get it early. So. He's tempting Marcus. Yeah, no, not going to buy. <laughs> um... Marcus is traditionally anti otters, famously. Yes, we gotta figure out a way to get over to these cats. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna make my rounds <clears throat> next turn. He's already he's yeah. already made his his spine. <laughs> so Marcus has won two games in the first four rounds, and both times with Erie. Really? Uh, so I think I'm gonna do. Yeah. Um, Not living up to his namesake, there is he? I... Of course, one of them was a very. Uh, controversial coalition win mm. where it was like at the very end of the game and Marcus was going to win anyway in the Vagabond coalition. That's right. We just basically Maybe snuck in. Missing something. Um, how did you have three guys? You just, you recruited uh, last I recruited last turn. Yep. 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 Okay. Um, and actually I think I need to recruit and then dig and then I can move out of there. Because the lies are tied. Oh, you got a tunnel token you want to throw over there as well? Sure. Sure. Look at us. We're just having a we're having a party in, in the past. <laughs> party in the past. That's what the P is for. Yeah. And then for <laughs> my minister action, I'm going to move over here. Oh. Okay. Interesting. He um, must be really working with some uh, cards in his hand that he does not want to uh, spend. To dig into Fox and then to move over to the other corner. Yeah, that's interesting. 
I'm just sway. Oh, he has coffin makers. Um, that could be lucrative on this in this game. I think I'm gonna leave this guy behind. Sorry, I'll leave two behind. Otherwise, the otters are gonna be too opportunistic. <clears throat> I will sway the formal for one point. Um, I'll open up. Also, a fun piece of trivia. Or another point. Uh, Marcus has only played in third or fourth turn order in the tournament so far. Yeah. That is a really interesting Six, fact. Four. And uh, that stands. Actually, that changed at this game. Going first. Okay. Now draw one. All right. Um, so we've got a brig and a and formal. A formal. A I like it. Now. With a coffin maker's in hand. <laughs> right. Let's see what you got. Two blues, two mouse. I think going swole is probably the right choice in this game. It's going to be too busy, so three. too bloody to make small mole like work. I yeah. I mean, I, I told you I would spend your warriors. I'm not going to hold on to them. He's gonna spend I think you got to negotiate harder than that. Yeah. I don't think you can just promise like three, then I can spend the other two, but I can't. There's no way. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I need to spend them in even numbers. I mean, you could. You could just recruit for the third. That's true. I mean, I could, but I like putting trading posts in. Hmm. <clears throat> Tell you what. For now, I'm good. But. What right. I'll do is uh, let's throw another card down. Let's do a. Hmm. I think Shoe Crown really missed a trick, not putting his prices at two. He probably could have gotten two or three sales that way, and now he's gonna be lucky to get one. Yeah, we could sit here all night talking about the two versus three price. <laughs> yeah, you know where I stand. Values. <laughs> <laughs> There's no wrong answer. Customer is always right. That's right, murder. So Competus also has won two of the four games in the first four rounds. On to battle. I think all these guys should have two wins, right? Two. And then, oh my God, two. Well, the other thing I'm looking at is the factions that they've won with. Yeah, that's a big yeah. key. Well, Lily says no. Battle the middle, have a good old boxing match. Uh, that's it. So I'll just recruit two. Oh, uh, yeah. Jerm Curry pointed out the saboteur is going into the decree while the moles are holding coffin makers. Coffin makers. Yeah, I was about to call that out. It's a very good insight red clearing so we'll just take these two and then this one oh he's saying pro eerie strat oh he's on the other side of this <laughs> uh, the one here with you're wrong mouse. jerem you're wrong mouse clearing first yeah all right questions? go ahead all right one one Uh, and then uh, second battle um, with you, Marcus, in this yeah, go box. Ahead. All right. One oh. Not quite what the Eerie want to see right. at that point. Um, and then I'll build for last one. There we go. So uh, I'll score two points. I got gotcha. you. Oh, thank you. And then I think the ideal strategy for the Eerie here is two cards this time. just really balancing recruit and battle and just keep the population down for everybody else. Good old BBC strategy. Alrighty. Yeah, My just take take best. warriors off the board, make it harder for everybody else to do what they want to do. <laughs> um, well, uh, I mean, let him see what he can do with, with three funds. <laughs> I know, I know. As tempting as it is, I, I gave you your guys right back. I, said, I do appreciate that. I do appreciate that. Waterman did have a vagabond 
coalition win. More. Yeah. I still have bird cards for you. As a Harrier. Uh, Ooh. For the time two Vagabond I, games. I am going to... I'm going to let it pass. I'm so sorry. That's okay. You don't have to be sorry. You know, I'm thinking Marcus may have evacuated to that opposite corner because Eerie... Genuine consideration, though, I will say. Yes. Genuine consideration. Because Eerie went BBC. All right, it's Birdsong. Sawmills are making wood. Makes sense. Yeah. Because if it was really about being in a bunny, there's a bunny right on the way to that one. So I think that, that makes a lot of sense. Open up this path. For one point. No, not going for a dom. That's silly. We're going to <laughs> march. I'm going to go here. And I'm going to go here. I'm going to build a recruiter. He is blocking in Using those two wood here. For two points. Two. Is that going to get in Mole's way, or is that going to help them turtle? Uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and recruit. <laughs> oh, boy. That is... I did this the worst way. <laughs> I think that's actually bad news for the cats. And then maybe not right away, and yeah, but soon. That's... Yeah, it's three actions, right? That's three actions. Call that a turn. Okay. Wow. Can oh we... God! I just drew like forty-five cards. Hold on. I don't oh, know. No. <laughs> Can we undo? <laughs> yeah, Let's I just rewind, wanna... Derek. Yeah, can we rewind real quick? Hold on. Just go ahead and shuffle the deck and, and redraw. Rewinding time is gonna be more screwy than it is. How many How many cards did you have, Waterman? I drew eleven cards. <laughs> no, but how many did you have in your hand before? I had zero. Oh, oh, yeah, okay. then just oh, take off the tap. That's fine. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just... I double-tapped the one accidentally. Yeah. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, do you have to rule a clearing to play a card to remove a pass, or you just have to be in the clearing? You just have to be adjacent to it, either All side. Right. And it's and it's from the clearing that you're... So you have to play the card that's... Um, I guess, like, my question is, like, I can play from here, right, for this pass with, yeah. a, with a mouse card? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, with right, any card. Oh, with any card. Oh, that's cool. Um, all right, I have uh, three guys, or I had I had the one come back, the two go into payments because of protectionism. Um, uh, I'm going to uh, let me draw a card. See what I get. Man, a lot of mouse cards. Ooh, mouse partisans isn't terrible. Um. Um, hmm. Oh, and can you play the um, card at any point, or does it have to be at the beginning? For the uh, any time, the, the rules are on the right side of the screen. Let's uh, see. Uh, oh, yeah. Once during daylight. turn during daylight. All right, yeah. So I'm I'm in daylight, so I could do it. Um, so I'd like to play the uh, master engravers. Um, remove this pass right here for a point. Um, and uh. Mouse Partisans. I mean, Mouse Partisans is pretty cool. I guess it's just another good card to have up there. Uh, I don't know if the mouse clearings are important enough this game. Two of them might be. I was, yeah, I was looking at that. I was trying to figure out who might be interested, but yeah, it didn't seem all that advantageous for anybody. Maybe Eerie down here. Yeah, those two next to the pass might be important, but it doesn't seem... Well, three, really. Yeah, I guess you have a point. It is three. That might make it better. Shoe Crown, uh, Shoe Crown by the way, won twice with Duchy. So it should be noted that he had the opportunity to, to take the moles, but did not. I will... I'll recruit here. Will I recruit there? Yeah, I guess I'll recruit there. That's only. Um, on my turn, 
uh, get a point for ruling the pass. Are you right? changing your prices at all? Uh, no, I like my prices. Hmm. That should have been an indication that they're willing to buy it too, but not three. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> you got to be able to read the table. I mean, especially after two rounds of three with no sales, I think you got to. You just got to bend your right. bend your will. I gotta take oh, he's going to buy it anyway. Okay. okay. Interesting. He must really need it. Okay, okay. hold on. Yeah, I expect you to spend Oh, uh, here we go. Two of those. Mm. Not I'd say no. All right. If if you I'd agree to it, then I'd go back on that. You know, so Lean Potato made a comment earlier about not feeding the otters too much. Um, and I expect you to have all all three of them spent by in two turns. Otherwise, I'm coming after you and i actually okay. think the table Ooh. might want to feed otters a little bit but to I handle the cats card draw or move out of the one but I, i'll spend the sure. other I'll spend no. two right away okay all right so then um recruiting one um lily wants a promise cube from you john <laughs> <laughs> I am a man of the Corvids. <laughs> okay, and then I'll build. Yeah. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Go for the market. Market. Uh oh. Um, market. I know. First building. He's not playing small mole. All right. We got to hit him. <laughs> what? I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. You need to hit me if I can play small, but I'm not. <laughs> Are you, uh, so you recruited with your second action? Yeah, yeah. Okay. And then um, with my... He's building again with formal, right? So with my formal, I'm going to build again. Oh, he's splitting. One and one. Mm -hmm. And with uh, my um, my strange addiction. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Now, I'm just completely making this up, but when I think about when the table starts getting all weird about, okay, I need you to give me those back on the next turn or whatever, mm -hmm. I think what I do is I, as I turn to one player, I'm going to, and I focus on the two of us kind of working together and just, you know, okay, don't worry about it. Don't buy from me. I'll work with this player. It's interesting. I wonder how I don't know if it would work. Be. I've never, never actually tried it, but <laughs> I don't, I don't like that whole. You need to spend those on your next turn or whatever. I just, to me, I just don't think that, I don't think that makes any sense. There's no reason it, uh, to keep them back to you. It seems to be the one thing that everyone pushes for, and they push for it so hard that it almost makes the deal not worth it for otters in many cases, because they need to try and keep those warriors for a turn or two to really get that yeah, they value. Need to get the card. Yeah, they need to move around. I like to ask the otters to do stuff like, you know, take out this thing, take out that thing. Because like I feel like I have to plan everything out perfectly, and if I change my mind, it's dumb. All right, uh, I'm just gonna commit to what I've done, even though it's suboptimal. And uh, sway. Um, Swole mole really is an efficiency puzzle. Marshall, one more point. Right, that efficiency so puzzle that efficiency puzzle aspect is actually why I'm surprised he split then, buildings because Fugless is a, a loud advocate of sticking with one type of building in order to get the most value off of your lords yep there's uh -oh. coffin makers oh no oh and that's why he cra that's why he built the two buildings yeah yeah of course here we go We got one saboteur buried in the. Uh... Uh, can we get a copy of the coffin makers out? Sure. Let me work on that once I end my turn. Cool. Let's see what's the best place oh, for this. Oh wow, that's scary.
There we go. Well, if anybody has the saboteurs, now is not a bad time uh, to play it. Hmm. Yeah, I do not. But he says with the saboteur in his decree. <laughs> um, jeez. Mm, hey, Michael Germ. Uh, let's see. What do I want to do? I like that murder she wrote. <laughs> I know it's a personal taste, but I, I prefer the just a box drawn on the table instead of actually having the coffin maker's card <laughs> sitting on the table. All right. Um Oh, did you want to purchase a card for me? <laughs> uh, the afterthought sales. No, nah, I'm cool. <laughs> it's okay. I, I I got three warriors sitting in my uh, payments, so not but not hurting. Yeah, exactly. Competus is a tough choice here. He's got to decide so where he's going to go. Because um, he's running out of easy clearings, you know. All right. Um. <clears throat> Let's do this. I'll... His best option is removing that path and going over to the Maker bottom Maker. mouse. Really weird now. Having or cutting up to that top mouse. I don't want to fill yeah. this card up with stuff. Oh, yeah. Like uh, weaker things. <clears throat> All right. If you do like a 3 3, you just give them a point. And Double battle is a good point, Cyber I mean, It's one point. It's what the cats are making every turn from all the tunnels that they're opening up. <clears throat> hey, Dutchie are really strong. Mm -hmm. And you don't want to be giving Dutchie free points. All right. Yeah, but mm. we'll have to see. We'll have to see what I can do. Um, I guess. Mm. With oh, double battle, he could probably take that top I'll right try. corner. Yeah, I'll try that. It would take um, some bad rolls to not take I it. I suppose. Uh, I'll just put a red card on. Oof. Uh, That's dangerous. With two battles in your decree, suited card and recruit is just asking for trouble. He's thinking about it. He doesn't like it. All. Ah, uh, fuck. I'm gonna recruit. I'm gonna put that in my hand. Cool. If you guys saw it, I'm gonna use it still. I just. Not sure if I want to use it here. With this stuff. Um, I have to move, I have to build. Jeez. All right. Yeah. I'll, I'll just put on recruit and then, uh, I'll recruit four. That's the thing you never want to see is BBC. You never want to see a suited recruit because that's where they're going to turn well you. Uh, and that's all going mm. right here. And then I'll move. Uh... He must be going for that corner. It's a good question, Jaren. Let me check. He has eight in his supply. Oops. I'll move. Yeah. Let's do all. I'm sure you want to do that? That's that's risky. I mean, yeah. you, have to go, you have to have enough to be able to build there or you turmoil. Right, right. Um, I don't know why he just doesn't remove the path down below. Oh, the problem is he's got a fox move, so that's really the only place he can go. Yeah. I think, I think he's setting... I think they're falling into the classic trap of worrying about each other and not the cats. I mean, how many times yeah. have we seen mountain um, cats surge ahead I, when they're just left alone like yeah. this? It is a little risky, but I mean... Uh, let me pull that up. Let's see how it goes. I'll uh, I'll do first battle on moles if you guys have a uh, ambush. I do. All right. Oof. So I'll take two off and then... Whoa. Oh, that's weird. What did that just come from? Uh, mm -hmm. there's like so in the tournament, uh, three games were played with mountain with mountain cats. Cats or four games, three of them were wins. I'll take them. 
Oh, 75% of the time they went on the <laughs> mountain map, according to our, Go ahead. our Damn. very small data set. <laughs> if you can even call that a data set. Is that enough? It is, right? That is. Yeah. It is. Just yeah. Well, that's fight one. He's got one more. Um, I was hoping right, he'd roll I'll... like 3-3 three, three and just wipe himself out. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'll have to... Uh... That's not enough to... Um... I'll have to do another battle anyways, but uh No, I mean yeah, yeah. Well you have to, you have to battle someone, so yeah. Right. That's the only the place. Are at five right now, right? With the tunnel and four dudes. Uh the tunnel doesn't contribute towards yeah. rule. Okay. Really? So, currently Yeah, tied no, you're you're fine. You can build there. But it, yeah. But if it All right. if you're if you're thinking about battles, oh whatever, you know, do what you want. Yeah. I'm I'm gonna just hit the cat then. Because if it's 1 1, it still gives them a point because you would both, you know, and that's kind of the most likely outcome. So if, you, if you're thinking about giving him points, you know, uh, if it's 3 3, you would give him another point, but otherwise he only has nine. Mm -hmm. Wait, did you say you were going to attack the cat here? Yeah, he's mm -hmm. attacking the cats. But if you lose but, a warrior, then you won't be able to build. Yeah, you won't be able to build. That's another. Oh, really good okay. I, I... <laughs> <laughs> They're mathing it out. Yeah, yeah, I was just waiting for them to figure that out. <laughs> Marcus is just like, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> go, ahead. go ahead. Thanks for catching that, guys. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it didn't matter anyway. <laughs> didn't matter. <laughs> All right. Wow, that could have been disastrous for you, dude. <laughs> Most oh, certainly. Man. Well, we live another day. Take my three points. You do. <laughs> you survive. <laughs> Here I am like, oh, if you hit his cat, then he still gets a point for uh, coffin makers. And Waterman's like, yeah, and then you turn well. <laughs> <laughs> Competitor's just here to make us all nervous. <laughs> I don't know why he was advising you. I mean, he kind of wants you to fail yeah. so that he can <clears throat> have the board to himself. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, I mean himself and the duchy. Riverfolk, what's up? Dude, my best my best and only customer. Oh, oh, not only anymore, yeah, but my best customer because you're going to make another purchase, right? <laughs> um, here's the thing. I think by giving you a total of six meeples and payments, it's just... It's just gonna unbalance the board a little too much, I think. I'm throwing them right back at you, though. I'm like, I'm not hoarding <laughs> your warriors. I'm not. I'm not holding on to them. I'm. I'm giving. Uh, I'm giving Marcus his warriors back, and if you do another three, I'll give you your warriors back right away too. I understand. I understand. I'm. I'm gonna hold off this time, but I've got my eye on those prices. I'm just. I'm ready for. Ready for kind of drop. <laughs> yeah, I'm just. These are all a bird ambush uh, another, and then other bird and then ambush like the mouse partisans these are good cards they're three worthy when they I are good cards, cards but when i have in this economy in this economy <laughs> in this economy warriors to play with right now this is the best <laughs> time to get them and i'm giving them right back to you Ooh. times are tough you can only afford to sell two of his warriors in slave labor not three as trade posts or as recruiting uh one one trade post and then uh, usually if i have just one i'll hold on to it for a turn but like i'll give you your warriors back if you ask for them waterman if you're going to buy from him i would highly suggest you whack him uh immediately afterwards because otherwise that army is going to stomp us well I'm, I'm not going on the rampage at this point if anything i just want to hold on to the uh i just want to hold on to the uh middle clearing just for the point point gain and which you can always get by the way if you want to purchase mercenaries that does make sense. Um, oh, the thing is, is I'm just going to hold off for right now because I, I, that's fine. I think it would just be too greedy of me right now, and I, I would prefer to have a, like a better objective. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine with it. I, I, you just, you're the one who started the conversation this time. So that's fair. That's fair. I was just kind of <laughs> seeing what's up. I just want to keep the conversation alive. Okay. <laughs> you know, you're welcome. You're welcome to oh, next turn. Waterman, the talker. Okay. Let's go ahead and throw some wood down. Almost. Uh, wow, we actually had 12, 
12 appearances in the river folk in this tournament. I thought we very rarely uh, saw them. I'm going to go ahead and craft. I seem to remember that. League but... of Adventurous Mice. Uh oh. It's good for cats. Yeah. <laughs> Someone gotta... just like, uh oh. <laughs> it's got to be able to keep the crafting up, Those though. Mice, they're getting adventurous. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay they're getting hopped up on coffee and they're they really out. are <laughs> um okay so i'm gonna start by building spent two wood yeah that sounds about right to me cyber kills and, and lily sawmill i remembered otters Three not points. showing up much in the beginning and then they had a resurgence near the end Gonna recruit? Yeah, there was only one Otter's appearance in the first round, three in the second round, four in the third round, and four in the fourth round. Yeah, there you yeah, go. Yeah, they were only available one time in the first round. I believe that they were taken. Because we had that wacky first round where we had like three double Vagabond games. Take a move. Yeah. Uh, March, I mean. And I'll move one. Um, and I'll move to Cyber Kills, it's almost more interesting to see people facing their specialization uh, sometime okay. because they know their weak points better, you know? it. It's and this weird dance. What I'm going to do is uh, open up this path with a card of course oh Ooh, traded a bird the card for it, right really. in. that's wild and that'll do it look at these mountain cats doing mountain cat things doing mountain cat things <laughs> all right my turn i got five all right so rich Okay, giving you your warriors back right away. I told you how to do it. Much appreciated. Totally unnecessary. Appreciated. So, there you go. Um, <clears throat> hang out. I'm going to put a post here. He made so a non-binding deal. Point later on, but you also get to trade more with me if you if you want. So that's pretty cool. Mm. I agree. Cyber kills. That um, that bird card for our pass is weird. Uh, I'm going to. But I guess it's also denial. Card, I think. Um, Ooh, propaganda bureau. Well, if he wants another bird card, he'll just go buy one. Hmm. It has to be the same, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. To to build it, right? It has to be three of the same. Uh, no, it can be three of anything. That's oh. what that symbol means. It's, it's wild. Okay. So if I had enough guys, I could build it, but I can't. Um, interesting. Yeah. Uh. Um. I will. I'll craft the crossbow. I've had these bird cards out here forever, and nobody seems to want it. So we will put it down. Um, and then, um, before I, well, I mean, I already did it. But um, am I still in daylight if I do a move action? Because I, I might want to clear a pass. So. You know, like, can I move? Uh, can I move? Yeah. Uh, yep. Yeah. So I can do, like, move um, here, and then um, I'll play uh, Mouse Partisans for, uh, I'll play, yeah, Mouse Partisans to get rid of this pass right here for another one. Okay. Was he able to move? And then... I still rule it, right? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. He had no, you don't. six dudes. No, I don't. Oh. Then that was kind of stupid. All right. Um, it's I a good know. question, Rodney. You denied it to the cats, right? Like the cats can't yeah. uh, get that. Pass it's one yeah, or the birds. So. It's hard to evaluate how good uh, one point that denies the others a point. Really worth it. All right, whatever. Is worth. That's my turn. He never actually grabbed that crossbow. I wonder if that's going to be an issue. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> it's fair to like. Um, oh, first off, um, Erie, you can get your stuff back from the coffins. I'll be right back. Thank you. Okay. I'll move and I will move over here. <laughs> um, I'm gonna battle you cats right there. Good to see someone doing it. We're over here? Yep. Okay. I'm gonna ambush. Uh, you Oof. just drew that stupid thing. Lame. Oh, forgetting coffin makers. Okay. Uh, you, they go to the coffins. Oh, oh yeah. three zero. Rip. It's a good uh, roll for Marcus. Battle again to get rid of it. <laughs> he hasn't gotten his point yet. And then, um. Lily, if you want that emote, you have to become a tier two subscriber. I think. Three in here. I don't actually know what that means. How did I get three in there? Oops. I don't know where that came from. There's a dangling eerie warrior here. I don't know where he's. Um, oh, that one was supposed to go in here. My bad. Okay. Yeah, because I don't know where that. Well, now there's a mix-up at the morgue, and they can't figure it out. with the card. Yeah, that makes sense. Um. Ba, 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 ba. All right. So then, what do I got? What do I got? Ooh, we're we're pumping and dumping, huh? Kind of, yeah. <laughs> pumping and dumping. Yeah, just abandoning some. No, I still got nice the marshal, so I should I can move him back. Um, so it's gonna do that now. No tunnel and there. And then I will. Can't reinforce it easily. Going to build. Oh, we picked up a rabbit partisan. Market. That's a good craft for him. Here. That's Oof, a really yeah. good craft for him. And then I'll sway the mayor. Yeah, and you called that out earlier, the rabbits, the yeah. rabbit clearing. And now his engine's online. He's got Bridget and double Bridget. And, and also, he's ready when the coins pop up. Yep. As soon as they show up. Two points. So long as he can hold on to it. Because that... that that bottom left corner yeah. is just asking to oh, be invaded. And I scored for that sawmill I destroyed. <laughs> mm -hmm. Wait. Yeah, the otters should just do it now. There you go. Okay. And then for crafting, I'm going to craft um, the bag, or sorry, the boot. And I'll craft rabbit partisans as well. Um, so casually. <laughs> And that should be it. Let's see if they remember to take the item this time. I'll draw three. <laughs> Not so far. <laughs> oh, that's twice. Come on, guys. You know, we could make a we could make a quick pivot and just say for the semifinal games, you are willing to intervene. This position right now, because look at and the set up here. Got not to necessarily make rulings, but to remind them of stuff like that, since all of them are going to be streamed. Pretty nice. Yes, if you're gonna come after me, you're gonna you're gonna take some heat. <clears throat> I thought about it a lot. I straight for this coffin makers. That's a nice setup. Yep. I think it's better to leave them to rules enforcement right, table, for so now. Can do something about that, or <laughs> sure. <laughs> uh, I can contribute warriors if people um, purchase. Yeah. Also, is there feedback coming through for me? I just put in um, my uh, headphones got unplugged, so now it's coming through my speakers. Is that okay, or should I try and? 
get the uh, headphones working again. You sound yeah, fine to me right now. Good. Okay. Yeah. Um. Shoe Crown, I would say that your mercenaries would be of more value if they were located. Oh, wow. We got, two, oh, we got three this? spam bots. Look three at spams that. at the same time. Well, Lily, can you take care of that? Like, I. You can commission me essentially to attack the um, duchy, but you just have to give me some warriors to work with, which you could purchase a card, and then I can do the move actions, move and attack actions. Right? Uh, you're a mod, Lily. Really. If you click on their name, you can ban them. Right? Because isn't it only one river movement away? <laughs> Cyber X kills wants is, to be yeah. famous. <laughs> I, yeah. Don't. Everyone wants to be famous. They don't want to ban them. <laughs> well, I am salty about that. But I think, in addition, the, I think it's principled to uh, look at the sort of towering faction that's fully online right now and and say, hey, we should probably balance this. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just because like mayor and brigadier plus like a lot of defensive stuff, it's the moles are getting ready to be hard to stop. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. Right. Um, yeah. No, that is right. Let's see. Uh, well, I had to add to my decree right now. And I, it's not looking too hot. <laughs> but I think Part of the birds, I'd just go the other way. I'd say I'm out of this. The and then move, go down south. Yeah, that's exactly... You have plenty of warriors if you want to get a card. That double battle is the real problem, you know. Yeah, the blue. just tell the otters they have to go nice. into the into the I'm just scared about rabbit clearing at the bottom and take out those buildings. Yeah, a couple turns later, it holds me I back. I mean, like move is a pretty safe one to put in. That's right. the safest for the most part. Mm -hmm. I think I'm just gonna have to do. Uh, I'll do a. Move from mouse. It's the one card, and then uh, right now uh, or at any moment, I could remove a one of these blockades from the path. Yep. Just discard any card. Yep. Cool. Uh, I'll do that then. I'll just discard this. Um, okay. Cool. That's the last path. <laughs> there we go. He finally did it. You go. put it over on your side, kind of a way to keep count who got what passes. Uh, I, I keep think, them as like. Trophies. I think someone just double scored him. <laughs> yeah. Sure thing. All right. Um, cool. So. Yeah, I think so. Now we'll do a. Uh... <laughs> yeah. It's... We'll do rules enforcement for the finals. I think. <laughs> I'll do a. Um, <laughs> before I actually resolve my decree as well. Um, craft this false orders. See, this is why people should only handle their own points. And then, yeah. Yeah. So now I'll resolve. So I have to recruit from a red and from any other one. So uh, first we'll do the red. I'll um, do it down here. And then I'll recruit from uh, this mouse one here. Ooh, I don't like that. All right, and then I'll do a move from a red. So we'll just take these two warriors. Over he has here. six left in stock, Rodney. Uh, move from a mouse. We will take one of these warriors. Maybe here. How do you claim that you're winning the game? Uh, yeah, and then... um. I'll do the battles. So, um, first battle with otters. You guys. Oh, what? I'm not gonna Interesting. Answer. Cool. Nice. All right. That is one dead otter. Coffin makers. There we go. So, yeah, they caught it. Uh, with moles. I'm just up in this rabbit one. If you have anything, <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> 20 finalists. Good idea, Cyber Kills. <laughs> Do you want to use mouse or uh, rabbit partisans? <laughs> no, I'll pass for now. Okay. All right. Um, and then finally, I will build. Yeah, that's, we're at one point with Coffin Makers right it's now. going down. 
over. Oops. Oh, thank you. Right there. So uh, that's about all I can do. I'll uh, score four points and draw two cards. One, two, three, four. Mm. All right. I'll just shoot Cole a message and say that we need uh, okay, 11 more folks. factions so, for the final. Are we on the same page about... <laughs> Can we get those in two weeks? <laughs> Although, everyone's getting online. It's, it's, it's getting... Don't worry about balancing them. Yeah, I mean... Uh, uh, I think the Eerie is definitely the scarier of the two. I'm like, I know I asked you just to... Uh, uh, just to commentate, but could you also design and release 11 factions? No big deal. <laughs> um, I mean, here, how about, I mean, you, how about I just let you choose? I mean, if you purchase from me and tell me to hit somebody, I'll hit somebody. So if, if you think it should be the Eerie or you think it should be the Duchy. I mean, Machosu, you Duchy. looking for a ban? I can ban you. Um. Yeah, if you... Would be willing to attack the duchy in this corner, then nice. I'll buy from you this turn. Yeah, I'll do that. Dig it. Entanglement. All right, cool. Well, then I'll buy from you. At three, though, come on. <clears throat> I mean, otters have um, three funds before that. I'll go ahead and grab this ambush. It's not the end of the world to let him have three funds. All right. It's bird song. I'm also it's worried about bird. that, Lily. Cats are getting off easy right now. But at the same time, Eerie um, is pulling go ahead. Craft saboteurs. Hmm. Ooh. Okay. Coffin maker's gone. Um. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is. That's true, Rodney. You did lose a sawmill. Uh, I'm going to go take a march action. Cats really have three building spots. Three with a potential exactly two more about to open up on the otter player's turn. Question. Yeah. Mm. Point made on the yeah, on the Eerie, but the Eerie have it's one. Never mind. It's too late. Uh, one at most. Yeah. Oh, are you asking about buying something else already? I'd be planning a turmoil yeah, right I was now. Gonna say it's just like if he uses his partisans against me, which I could totally see Marcus doing. It's just we might kind of blow each other out. If you were to get mercenaries from me. Then I would I would use them I would give I would just put them into warriors just to have a little bit more of a force on the board to ensure that I um, remove them and don't leave like you know I think he kind of there. wants you to use up all your stuff <laughs> I don't think he wants <laughs> you to have an army after this <laughs> I'm just saying I, I mean it's not a terrible idea I just I, like I'm far less of a force on the field if we just blow each other up which you know eh, it is what it is. Yeah, I hear what you're saying. Um, it's Rue. Everyone's just working for the, to advance their self-interest. But with that in mind, I do think that our interests are aligned in uh, keeping the like, kind of I, wrecking ball of the duchy from just steamrolling everybody. Because yeah, there, I mean, there will be plenty of battles that will not spare outer warriors in the future. You know what I'm saying? So, like, it's just like, do you want to spend the material early where it can count or just kind of wait to be steamrolled that's that's the way that i'm looking at the board right now is that's how I'm i was thinking. just saying if you were to buy mercenaries just to give me some more warriors to work with i'd put them to good use i could put more cards and you know into payments i can make sure that this is dead i mean as it is i'm not gonna like if i attack and it's not good i'm probably just gonna back out i see i think he's yeah i have definitely gone to the next phase since I crafted yeah, Saboteur, unfortunately. You did. You, did. You, you did. I should have caught you a little sooner. That's okay. But how about this? How about this? Uh, next turn, I'll I'll replenish 
your warrior supply. Okay. And like I said, I'll give them right back to you. Dope. All right. Well, with that in mind, um, I'm going to take a march action. And move this guy over here. And then I'm going to build. A sawmill. For two points. And then I'm going to recruit. It's a smart build. It eats up the easy spot that Erie had. And you're getting the pass point now, right? That's right. Um, okay, so I'll get a pass point, draw two cards, and call it a turn. Now, Shoe Crown, before you start, hear me out. Um, <laughs> if you uh, uh, decide to back out on Waterman's deal and not attack me, you don't lose any warriors, and I will buy a card from you on your turn, on my turn. Um, that does sound good, but then, like, nobody can trust you what I'm doing, essentially. And I said that if he buys a card, I'll attack. So, like, it's important that I follow through with what I said I was going to do. I mean, you're um, all about that money, though. You're not... I mean, you can play... Like, oh, he likes war, too. It's about the win. About the winning uh, the game, yeah, right? But it's also just important that I, I, I follow through with things that I'm going to say. So, at this point, I'm just right. wondering what the most efficient way is to hit this right here. It's going to hurt oh, you. Yeah. yeah. Um, I do Marcus appreciate already... it. I should have been saying that when I, we were we were doing diplomacy because I would have weighed weighed the option then. But like after the fact, I'm not going to change what I was going what I'm going to do. No, no, I, I got. I mean, I had no skin in the. In yeah. Marcus already used a rabbit card. ambush yeah. card. Do we think he has yeah. a bird ambush in there? I, my, like, I would totally listen. No, because um, we saw both of them get used. You've seen both. I, need to, I see okay. one in the discard. Yeah. I mean, I'll throw you a bone. Cats played one, and then the uh, otters had one. Unless... Okay. I think it was I the same they... one. Uh, yeah, but... I'm going to place it uh, here, so he's probably just going to be used against you. But like I said, I, I told you I was going to give you a back. Um, <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, now we're going to... We're going to move an attack. Uh, ooh, not that. <laughs> Sorry about that. Um... Here, we can I'm just wondering if it's if I should just place more warriors. Uh, no, I think move and attack is probably fine. Uh, I don't want all five. I wanted four. And um, we'll do the first attack. Um, do you have an ambush? No, go ahead. Yeah. Will it be worth it to use partisans, though? Let's find out. Two, one. Two, one. Uh... I mean, he can't afford to give up that whatever is in his hand, can he? Yeah, right, probably not with a um, full hand. We're attack again. Partisans is bad when it's not your turn. Right. Yeah. All right. That'll do it. Good to go. Um, I'll get two points for that. Only one price of uh, failure, at least. Do I want the point for moving back? Half price of failure. Um, <laughs> I have to decide between Brigadier and Mayor. Um, Is that really a choice, Marcus? Okay. Unless he's planning um, to pivot to Banker. Let's get a card. <sighs> um, six. The backside of the... Uh... Ministers' cards are definitely underestimated art or underrated, underappreciated. I do agree. My hand. There's just they don't have any place in the game, which is really unfortunate. Like I could get a point for moving back to the pass if I move everything, but then I leave a trade post. I got you, Marcus. Um, leave the trade post, man. Trade posts are liabilities. Um, let's go ahead and. Um, Let's see what Marcus lost. Ah, he lost his fox swords. Pass for the point. Fox swords. And uh, 
Yeah, that's fine. I think it's just okay. tied, right? Uh, did I did I jump over him, or was I? Oh, I just mean for presence in the pass. Oh, hold on. Yeah, it's tied. We got six to his six with his building. Yep, it is. Oh, oh yeah, just because uh, I got that building. All right. Um, yeah. yeah, sorry. In which case, I, I would prefer to stay back there. Is that okay with you guys? I thought I was going to get a point for doing that. Okay, so, so that means you still have out. one more uh, fund available then. Yeah. In which case, I'll just draw a card. Okay. Ew. Nice. Swap meet. And, Are um, you interested oh my, in my changing your prices, reducing down to two? Uh, um, I'd, no. I'd be open to buying if you reduce to two. Otherwise, you're not getting anything out of me. That's okay. Um, I do appreciate it. I'm going to leave them at three. <laughs> okay. I did give you your warrior back. I told you I was going to do that. So. I I know, but I can't oh, keep Marcus, buying at three. You're forgetting coffin makers. Oh, I'll score. To... Did you put my points over here with the ones you killed from here? Two, four, uh, six, eight, ten. All right, so I scored two points there. I have to run to the restroom real quick. I'll be right back. At least you got some value for it. Before it disappears. They do, Lily. They go to coffin makers. If they're spent, not if they're committed, of course. Are we going to wait for him, or should we play on? Go wait if it... Waterman also right, went AFK. Yeah. Why don't you wait a second? Yeah, and no, I'm just, just planning out my turn. Gives us some time to think. Gosh. <clears throat> that decision just to, to stay there just kind of messed up my plan, because I was hoping was going to move so I could mm -hmm. go back. Right, I figured. It sucks is that um, I'm in a situation, Competus, where like, oh hey, I want I want to keep I want to keep building, but I have to go into your areas to do that. You know, and I gotta keep expanding unless I I mean I'll probably end up turmoiling eventually. I mean. At least I only have two turns. I, I just hope wrist. that you can finally start going towards the cat. Yeah. Right now, they're just going to... Right I mean, now... They got, they got almost thinking, everyone out. I'm thinking yellow here, or, I mean, mouse here, because then I can start moving into here. But oh. this one is gets the same job done. It's just they have one more unit here. And I do need to put down the roost, so mm -hmm. it's the path of least resistance um yeah the middle one it's like it is appealing but just smashing through there's more warriors there but um i don't know i mean the three right. options are there it's just okay so i'm going to probably recruit twice Probably. No, probably about it. <laughs> Going to use the brig uh, to move these guys out. Um, when you, uh, you flipped your card, um, like the mole's not dead. Like it's the crown. No, right? he's not. That no. Yeah. The crown's gone. That's just how I do it. Okay. That's, my... that's fine. I just want to make sure like you could still potentially get him back. Yeah. Yeah. Like... No, I can get him back. Okay. Why is there a ruin token floating? Okay. 
It's a good um, question. But, but, uh... the, all the other four are in place, but the oh, for some it's reason they're... from that wonky invisible bag they were grabbing items out of earlier. Moving here. For whatever reason, it spawns like hidden beneath the table, and it still exists. I don't know why they don't just like despawn it. And <laughs> to remind people to take items. I wish, Rodney. Use... I wish. Can't wait to see people craft a third boot and a second crossbow. Huh. Um, uh, going to use this uh, formal to build another building. Um. No, the only one boot was crafted. They just didn't take it from the display. And the otters crafted the left, right? crossbow. Uh, crossbow, right? Yeah. Just debating. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I think it was Marcus who crafted the boot. I'm going to send him out here. Okay, and then <laughs> okay. And then yeah, so I'll sway. The yeah, I think I'll just sway the mayor again. All right, two points, right? Yeah. All right, you're up to 13. Real question is, is he going to remove that crown? Still in the middle of the pack after a big setback. Yeah, but it's I'm the first player, so I should be in the lead right now. So I'm actually a turn behind everyone. Why is it flipped back over? Because he just swayed it, but he didn't, he didn't remove the third crown. Yeah. This is why you That's don't... That's really troubling. Player. This is why you don't do it yeah, this way, so Marcus. Then I will craft the T. It's good craft, though. Two more points. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> I give you those uh, two points. You're in the lead now. Uh, one point. All right, cool. Um, well, this this game is already ruined. <laughs> no kidding. Yeah. yeah. Right, cool. Two missed crafted items the, plus the uh, crown. Might as well craft swap meat. Here he got two points off of a path because they, he got double scored. And oh no, I'm only drawing two cards because you trashed my other one. So I'm not crafting a swap meat. Marcus is all kinds of mixed up right now. All right. Um, Can Competus pull it off? Uh, let's let's see. Well, I can't do it for the rest of the semis, okay. cyber kills, but I can do it for oh. the finals. Hmm. I just really want a backup uh, if I do it, and I couldn't schedule one like last right. minute today. You're actually going to use my uh, false orders now. I think I'm going to do it on. Hmm. This might actually be a good time to hit the cats. It's a very good time to hit the cats. On this middle spot with cats. That's okay. a risky one um, to go for. I'll just push them all over to your. Especially um, for just one point. Right here. Got it. That's a nice cool. thing to push them to instead of locking them down like here. Ooh, that would have been better. I mean, I'd almost prefer here so that I can attack the moles, but it's up to you. No, yeah. I, I like Waterman has a hatred of moles ever since <laughs> they burned down a, a sawmill. <laughs> <laughs> no, the cats never forget. We respect, we respect a 
factual. Again, a lot of jingoist cat literature in the presses these days. <laughs> yeah. uh, I'll also have to add to this decree. I'm just going to toss down a... Uh... Hmm. Toss I mean, at this point... On mouse. At this point, I'd almost say just go three battles, just scorched earth, motherfucker, you know? Okay. So, take these four dudes. I'm going to put them all right here. And then move one. We'll take these five guys. Coffin Makers is getting saboteured on Cat's turn, don't forget, murder. I'm really good Ooh. at saying things right before chat Look says your rolls, man. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Uh, and then we'll take them one or uh, this is going to I'm going to have to do two moves yeah, from you can go there and then there. You can is just it, move one. You can move is it one. It's possible to just split the group in half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two yeah. sets. Yeah, you can totally do yeah. that. That's totally cool. legal. Um, that's what I'll do. So there, are, yeah, five dudes there. Um, and then I have a uh, double battle to get to. So we'll just start with uh, cats here. If you have an ambush or anything in the fox clearing. We do an ambush. There's the second right, bird ambush. So that'll be two out. Um, and those will go on to. Yep. Cool. So I'll roll. So I think the fox ambush is the only one we don't know where it is. Oh, no. Two, two. two. I think he's turmoiling. It's not over. He's got one more fight, doesn't he? Mm hmm. Um, that sucks. Because that is. One dude left. Oh, yeah, there's no way. There's no way to avoid it, right? Because oh, he doesn't roll. He doesn't now roll. He can't beat the, beat out the moles. Yeah. Oh, that's fine. Right. Turmoil on build. Slot in order to build. Mm -hmm. um, Grab yeah. the point. Uh, I. He only loses I four guess points. My last battle. Uh, smack the recruiter. He almost should have bought Merc's as backup. So, uh, it's one. DP. Worst case scenario, just build in All the right. bottom left corner. So, um, obviously, so build won't happen. Uh, let's go through the turmoil order. So um, it'll be minus four VP. Yep. Plus four VP, so you don't move at all. Yes, and that will just stay the same. Uh, and then discard decree, dispose leader, and then go to evening. All right, so that's... Uh, uh, just for the uh, for the audience, uh, he said dispose of the leader, but it should be depose. We just we don't uh, we don't uh, endorse that kind of treatment to animals. We will depose them because it's you know theatrical and hilarious, but disposing of them is a little bit violent. Yeah, it's all good. Root's not a violent game. We're not we're not for animal abuse. <laughs> <laughs> there's a game there's a card called coffin makers uh, uh, can i field hospital my two cats i was uh, like yeah that's fine yeah. About that. yeah go ahead i'm fine with mm. that. i don't know if i love, love that it's a little that late, late but what, field what card did you play for that a bird card uh the corvi planners all right so yeah. draw two and then uh waterman's got no shortage of bird cards in this game Sharp uh, contrast to so, the last Cats game from earlier in the week. <laughs> sure. Let's it's see, always a dangerous uh, cat game when they are drawing well. Hmm. All right, and then for the new leader, uh, where are we at? With only two warriors in his bag. It was a pretty. He was probably going to turmoil on his next turn anyway, so this actually isn't terrible. This is a great time to turmoil. Whether it's, he did it on purpose or not. Yeah, it's it's almost better that he turmoiled on the build than than on his next recruit. And I think it's at the point of the game where he doesn't want to to be too late as he's trying to get his engine back up and running. Yeah. So. Yeah. Exactly. We talked about that earlier about the. Did you already draw? 
Uh, Fear of Turmoil. Oh, yeah. Shoot, I did. That was totally wrong. You huh? should. Yeah, you should play that before you do. We didn't, we didn't catch it, though. We should have told you immediately after you turned. People do that wrong every yeah, time. Yeah, that's kind every of time. What did he do? He drew his cards oh, and now he's man. picking. Shoot. Oh. Uh, I mean, you guys want me to just pick a random between builder no, and commander? No, pick what's best for you. We've, we should have told you before drawing to go ahead and get a despot leader. There's no yeah. way builder is best for him. He's got two warriors. Coins or something nice. <laughs> <laughs> something uh, nice to craft. But I mean, like, with something the nice to craft, craft next turn. Even if you hadn't drawn it, there's only two items crafted right now. The builder is still a good call. Only two items crafted. They forgot the other two. <laughs> <laughs> then, <laughs> ah! <laughs> Pretty convenient. Um, Did not do fine. that, but. Uh, they are 100% going to cheat uh, yeah. this game. I cannot wait. Um, that is it. All right, does he remember to Sabo right, right now? Let's see. Um, start a bird song. I am going to play Saboteurs on Coffin Makers. wonder if you're going to remember that. Yeah. All right, here he gets their warriors back. Oh, thank you. Um, still got lots of crafted improvements over there, so it's... All right, it brings him up to Just six. I still don't love it. Card. I still think a good commander would have been defenses. terrific right now. The other way. Watermade, I'm wondering if you decided that I was your primary antagonist in this game before the game started or after I burnt your sawmill. <laughs> no, just the, the image of my industry up in flames is, haunts my nightmares. Um, haunts my feline nightmares. <laughs> Okay. Um, it's bird song, so let's get some wood going. Yeah, cats are in strong position right now. Three sawmills, tons of cats on the board. Three open slots. Um, it's like twenty cats on the board. Go. Yeah. March, March. Yeah, look at that. Is he gonna build twice? Wait, did you want to buy from me first? Um, I was going to, but I realized that I can't recruit my dudes if I do buy from you because yeah. there's just not enough. It, I it's fine. Enough I, dudes. I wanted to give you your guys back last turn, but I literally couldn't battle if I hadn't I'm done. It, yeah, that's so. fair. That's fair. And I, and I, I do is, recognize if you were to buy, you wouldn't be able to um, recruit either. So it's fine. Yeah. Shukran, you were the nicest otter player I've ever played with. <laughs> I, <laughs> I think I can say that fairly. Like, I swear Marcus has no memory otters, of playing otters with me. Otters are supposed, ever. To, it's supposed to be a symbiotic relationship. Like, <laughs> he consistently I, makes comments that like, I can see you right now, but I can ignore his experiences with me. Buildings down there in that corner, you shed a tear. <laughs> You're right, Lily. Marcus hates me. Particularly, I, I did give you your guy back. There wasn't really any reason to do that other than I told uh -huh. you I was going to do it. Otters are supposed to be symbiotic for every other player in the game. Like, I'm supposed to make you stronger. What's Waterman thinking about? Um, that's, gonna... that's one view of the otters. Recruiter <laughs> <laughs> here for two points. Gosh. It's two actions. And I'll go ahead and recruit. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> it's a dangerous situation, I think, when the cats have literally all their guys out on the board. Yeah. <clears throat> I mean, you know, the all but one. Theory just turmoiled, but they still have a lot of guys out and aren't in a particularly bad situation. They're getting the right now. They're getting um, what is that? Uh, are they getting three or four? four. The problem is four. the problem is he didn't pick commander, which means that it kind of falls on us to beat down on the cats. I guess it's unfortunate. <sighs> I don't know. It's just pretty tight between everybody. It looks like yeah. I don't really. I feel like everyone's done a good job of of 
making sure that no one else can do anything too extreme and run away with it. <laughs> Everyone's That's right, Murder. Waterman is always, Waterman is always to the uh, magnanimous to collaborator. Indeed. Or maybe three pass point. But yeah, so the like cat advantage has been muffled somewhat. Nev, you have missed oh, Item Gate, so the biggest scandal of the tournament. Um, just mulling over the end of this turn really quickly. I'm going to. Guess I'll just call it a turn. That seems fine. Uh, okay, I'll score a point for the pass and draw two cards and pass the turn. All right. Um, I get uh, protectionism kicks in. I get two warriors. Uh, move into daylight. Um, I wonder if they're going to start going after the cats now. I doubt it. That would require interactivity. Um, propaganda Bureau. Ooh, okay. Yeah. I do like Propaganda Bureau for cool. otters. Um, and I want to draw a card. All right, cool. Nice to have a nice to have a bird out. Um, oh, I crafted one of these boots and never grabbed it. Sorry. <laughs> About time. Marcus has redeemed himself from item gate. Another card. Ooh, that's nice. Um, can't craft anything. No, no, we got one more item, Nev. Your... Item gate's not resolved. Oh, yeah, you have. You would have three. You could still. Um, Purchase from me if you wanted to. Here you go, Cyber Kills. Um, yeah. I, like I said, I like giving people their ca their warriors back. I don't really ever want to hold on to them, um, so I will give that back to you, and uh, I will put it um, here. Uh, trade post. Yep. All right. Um, I'll get two points for that. Um, that's my turn. And I'll, I'll leave everything at three. There's good stuff here. I think Nev is in on it because he's keep, he keeps trying to say that it's resolved. <laughs> I think this, uh... Nev is pretty suspect. We should, uh, we should throw him off the ship. Yeah, I agree, Rodney. No propagation burnt, uh, uh, burrow is strange. Propagation. Okay, what's called propagation burrow. It's not propagation. <laughs> You're stealing that from Brian. No, I'm the one who made that up. <laughs> Brian said it. I don't think he meant to. He called it propagation burrow. Bureau, bureau and then I called it propagation burrow. Oh, okay. Ugh, hate this. All right. Uh, you have to promise to give me back two warriors. This uh, he doesn't card. have to do any such thing. Yes, I'm gonna pay Marcus you clearly card. needs this All card. Right. <laughs> Otherwise, he wouldn't okay. bother to buy it. So, oh, buddy, that card flew under the table. Um, oh, here it is. You have to promise. You have to. <laughs> you have to exchange promise cubes. <laughs> They're worth negative two VP at the end. I need a promise cube emote. Uh, da, 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 da. That card just sitting there is killing me. Take it back into your hand. Sorry, More guys, spam bots. I have to map this all out. <clears throat> I, yeah, it's a mole's uh, turn. It's okay. Oh, <laughs> it's it's a small mole turn. Like usually, like small moles, I don't have any problems with logic, but this is. <laughs> <clears throat> Everyone's becoming famous this stream. Four, five. 
five five so i need six warriors there it's twitch prime rodney or or amazon prime they're the same thing there that's easy and a fox and i have a mouse so I just need to move and move. So does Marcus have any intentions of policing the cats? Of the Erie, because he does have the builder <clears throat> and he's getting at least four points if no one hits him this turn. So assuming he um, has like a sword or something, he's going to um, get four and then be right at 20 with the builder and no way of turmoiling him. So yeah. just something to keep in mind. There's nothing I can do about that. I am going to hit this, though, this turn. So um, he's just scoring less from his roost every turn. Okay, so I'm going to recruit twice. And then uh, move in with my marshal. Uh, maybe recruit once and then move in. That's fine. I'm, I'm okay with that. Hold just on, hold on. Back. Let me just let me just think this out. All right, so I have four battles. If I do that, hopefully I can take it out in two. Yeah, I'm going to take it out. So I have my marshal still. Mm -hmm. um, I might need four battles to close this out. We'll see. All right, so uh, with Brigadier battling here. Yep. Um, Erie, ambush? No, I've got nothing. Ooh. Good roll. Yeah. All right. So this one stays. Three are gone. Okay. Battling again with the other Brigadier. Battle. Oof. Wow. Marcus with oh. the rolls. Good rolls. Oh. I'll give you the point for the roost. Thank you. All right. Um, then I'll build. Uh, with this fox. Yep. Formal. Leave my hand. I'm sorry, I'm getting a little bit of lag here. Let go. It's okay. Will this be the turn that Marcus tries to sway his fourth yep. noble? And for Brigadier. Sorry, sorry, my my mayor. Let's find I... out. I don't know who I should hit. I guess probably hit the otters here with the trade post sure. point. And they don't have any ambushes. Although I know the cats don't have ambush either. You're um um you're using the uh I, I guess you're just doing the mayor to do a double battle action. Correct. Yeah. Yep. All right. Um, go ahead. Yeah. So I'll hit the otters first. Yep. Go ahead. Ooh, good rolls. Oh, three okay. rolls in a row. Jesus. This is trashed. And... I should have hit the cats. If I'd rolled really well, I could have taken the pass point. No, it would have been impossible. All right. Um... <laughs> Everyone think Marx is gonna cheat. I love it. <laughs> yeah, but two zero, you would roll the pit, roll the. No, you wouldn't roll. No, I wouldn't. But I would. I would whittle him down a little, little bit, so that yeah. you could rule a little bit easier. I would like to. Roll. I, really nice. I. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like. <clears throat> Pretty well set up. Uh, oh, we got to know. So instead, I will just um, maybe I'll just skip out of my other battle. Oh, I didn't even know. I noticed I had this warrior out here. What did he get out there? 
You, you, you put them there so that you could sway. <laughs> you might still want to have them there to sway if you only oh, have two. Oh, I definitely want them there. Yeah, I I probably would have recruited it again if I'd known he was there, because uh, I was thinking I had to use my marshal to get uh, a warrior out here to this fox clearing. Yeah. Ah, all right, that's fine. So then I will battle. Uh, like cats there, eerie there, not bad. Yeah, I'll battle the, the Eerie again. Sorry, Eerie. No, oh, it's okay. So polite. <laughs> I have so you're good to roll. All right, roll in. Man, Marcus with the rolls. Yeah, okay. So All that's going to come to a screeching halt when he tries to sway his fourth noble, though. Uh, he just crushed Eerie into the dust. To move Marshall over here. <clears> okay. <throat> right. Um. Then for swing. Here it comes. Hold up, hold up. Uh, I've I messed up the math here. All right, no. I need two fox clearings. <sighs> I'm so sorry, guys. This is so, so dumb. <laughs> it's okay. Moles are hard. Okay, a yeah, lot it's of like twelve more like five D chess. <laughs> it really is. All right, so I need to move over here. Come on, do I it, have, Marcus. Uh, <laughs> okay, I gotta remember that this mouse card is in my. He may be going Lord though. I think he's going Lord this turn. The um... Marshall. Yep. Okay, you're Marshall. Because you already spent Brig and then uh, and then Mayor, right? On another. So brig. I'm going to because I'm going to use a Fox card, uh, a Bunny card, a Mouse card, and then uh, another Bunny card. <laughs> yeah, another Bunny card on Swing the Lord. There it is. Oh. It's the Lord. Oh, there it is. Okay. Damn it! It's okay, guys. Uh, yeah, there. the poll was for the game. Win. It I wasn't for the turn. Good. I guess who isn't? But <laughs> oh, moles crafting have, moles. Um, yeah, moles have the crafting potential for coins next turn. Just something to keep in mind. Uh, I mean, I have this it turn. this turn. I'm crafting. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the moles. And I'll craft the bag as well. So that's four more points. Jeez, dang. Yeah, I saw this market go down. I was like, uh oh. <laughs> Where have you been, Lord of the Board? We're 33 games in. We're almost over. I hit the moles for you guys. <laughs> I tried what I could. And I appreciate it. It clearly was necessary because even, even with a setback. Okay. The otters, the people's champion. <laughs> <laughs> Otters, you can get here in two moves. I could. Um, and I would not be opposed. Again, just need warriors. And I, I could even fulfill um, the duchy request by um, putting a, uh, a trade post there. I, I, need a, I need to fulfill the request of giving them their um, warriors back. That's fair. Okay, so I crafted a bag and coins. To grab the items. And the discards. Table's going to have a tough time stopping Marcus now. That was a hell of a swing turn. Got that. And discard that. Okay. <clears throat> All right. Yeah. Um, I'm I'm fine really not hitting you anymore, um, Eerie, since we've uh -huh. been kind of... I mean, you're getting a good amount of... Uh, I mean, three points. I don't know if it's enough to close it out, but we want you to be a factor and at least hit some warriors while you craft and get stronger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And at this point in the game, I have 12 warriors in bank. 
I'll probably buy from I'll, you right now as well. I was going to say, if you do buy from me, I'll put them immediately into war. So, <laughs> How much you guys think Eerie wishes he was commander now? And then take your pick. Let's see. The blue could be nice. You know what they say, always be not picking builder. <laughs> always be not picking builder. <laughs> Yeah, so they say that on the streets with kids. In from rabbit clearing, but um, false orders they, uh, are really strong too. If you don't grab those, I probably will. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe the ambush. Just keep what I have up, and yeah, ambush is strong too. I wonder if huh, if we could even seize it. A B N P B. Everyone knows it. <laughs> Everyone says it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'll grab the ambush, but um, I don't know if moles will be able to close it out next turn, anyways. All right, uh, moles about to get board wiped. I hope so. Uh, let's just do. If moles don't get board wiped, there is a problem. We'll just do a. Uh... Oh, wait, you have the third dude right here too, huh? All right. Yeah, sorry. Uh, I should put no, it it's all good. No, it's totally cool. Yeah. I'll just do a... Uh... Hmm, this is really interesting. I don't have much to really do here. I'll just put recruit for mouse and Yeah, there's the coins he was trying to craft. One of the coins. Um and then crafting. Yeah, uh that will be after my decree. Maybe a sword? First, so, um, what do you mean after your decree? I'll do my two recruits and then my one move. Well, actually, you craft before you do your decree. Oh, right. Okay, yeah. Uh, I was thinking, I don't know why I was thinking it was in Birdsong. I do have two things to craft. Um, okay, so I have a crossbow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! It happened! Did I... no, Hold on. Not... Oh, you didn't grab it, but I think I he did craft it. it. Right? Oh. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, yeah. Item gate. Uh, oh, item gate. item gate has been resolved. No, it's not a problem. Never mind. Sorry, I have another. Uh, I should have grabbed it from the pile. Then wasn't. Poor Competus. That is. No, no, that's cool. That's cool. That is I'll so sad for him. Um, and that is the hammer. At least he gets the hammer out of it. All right. I'm glad that you got something out of that. And I didn't just like give you all <laughs> <three tenths. laughs> No, it's it's cool. So that's two. All right. Um, yep. That's true, Rodney. He did get that double point from the from the path. Uh, just I'll put do it even out. One of them on mouse. One of them on. All the scandals resolved. And then vagabond was not cut, and in fact, we had three double vagabond games in a row in the first round of the tournament. It was a scandal there. unto itself. That is it. So uh, I'll score for three points. Draw two cards. Whoa. And that stuck. My bad. I allowed coalitions. The mad lad I am. Okie dokie. Um... Oof, that's a lot sitting in your payments box there, River Folk. You don't have to buy anything. Oh no, <laughs> don't do it. <laughs> I'm you, pretty you gotta, tempted. Yeah, I mean it's up to you, but you don't have. I mean, you pay him. Uh, you pay him. He could go for the win. Oh. Or he could police moles. 
I mean, it, it's up to you. I'm I'm gonna be hitting this corner up here because it's kind of the only thing that slows two, uh, Dutchy four, down. Six, yeah, that makes sense. Eight. And, and then it's up, to, and then it's up to you. PM. What you guys want to do I after that? Count. All right. If you're going for this corner, then uh, that's all fine. For, that's all fine with me. Yeah. So I will sadly pass up on the opportunity. Yeah. You you've been a loyal customer. I appreciate your um. I just believe in capitalism. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay. Question so is, are cats going to help police the moles? Go ahead and move into daylight. I'm not going to craft. Um, I'm going to go ahead and build a sawmill. And at home for three points. One, two, three. Now you start policing. Please. Gonna overwork one of those sawmills. Oh, nope. Waterman. Over here. It's not what I like to hear. And then build a workshop. Oh, shoot. You're just going for points. points. <laughs> <laughs> my cats what oh, happened to crazy. entanglement waterman <laughs> oh it's getting tangled <laughs> spending bird card uh, all right one fight correcting here. waterman it is it is not getting untangled <laughs> he's not even fighting now he's marching I'm gonna march some cats over here well, i guess it is getting untangled do you have another bird card waterman and then I'm gonna flip this T to Okay, he's using adventure mice. with the duchy. You got an ambush for me? Nope, go ahead. Alrighty. Two zero. Two zero. Got a bird card to finish it off. <clears throat> um I'm gonna spend another bird. There card. we go. Dang it. And I'm gonna initiate another battle here. Freaking A. <laughs> Bird card draw is insane. It's been pretty right, go good. Ahead. See if my dice rolling is up to. Ooh, oh, there it is. Right. Almost didn't have it. All right. And that's a point for the cats. Yeah, no wonder you didn't need to buy from me. <laughs> <laughs> you've had, you've been flush. All right, seven points. Can you do it next round? Probably. You have a lot and of. And then I ruled a pass, so I'm gonna get a point for that. Table says you can't draw all the bird cards. No, Waterman says bird. Goodness gracious! Now, I mean, I'm all. I was all for attacking the duchy, and it still nah, might not it's, be a bad it's, idea. You're but, either king making or you're going for the win yourself this turn. Yeah, I mean, the only person who's really on my side right now are the birds. <laughs> I did say that I was going to give you um, your cards back. I think the only place that you actually rule though is up here. Um, so. Um, here's a question for you. Um, do you want me to try, do you want me to use your pieces? Let me move everything that I have. Do you want me to use your pieces to give you your guys back like you asked, or would you rather me do battle actions with them? Uh, and I can specifically just... use your pieces for battle actions against the cats. If right. That's... No, uh, I mean... Slaughterman, can you discard a card from me? I think it's it's chill. I'm not going to recruit. Oh, and did we? When did we refill the deck, Waterman? Was that when you were drawing? So uh, it was after I drew. Yeah. So you drew the last card. You in could the, try to go. I drew the, the last deck. two cards. You get the win off of them. Definitely okay. go for it. But right. Yeah. So this no would be shuffled. Feelings. This would get shuffled yeah. in. Yeah. Do something. Uh, cool. We should see um, what that is. Oh well, I guess we don't get to see what it is. Sorry. I'll back back to you, Shukran. No, it's fine. I was just saying, like, I, I did say I would give you your guys your cards back, but I can also do some battle actions. Uh, I'm a little worried that, you know, the most yeah, four I... cards could potentially sway, could potentially craft um, for a win. 
So I, I'm, I mean, and I'm a little far behind at this point. So I'm in a bit of a king making position. Um, I just lost my one crafting point there. If that helps you make your decision, you just stole it from me. There's a bad. That violin just keeps on playing. No one is better at whining their way to victory than Marcus. I mean, let me tell you. <laughs> Sawmills is never a terrible idea. Uh, yeah, I, I'm for hitting the moles. They're more explosive than cats at this stage. Make the moles hit the cats. Yep, exactly that too. If moles can't win, and they have to hit cats back. I don't know. Any table talk? Anyone want to try and sway me one way or another? I have a lot. I, have a uh, reason I think at this point, I think you just you just make your decision, dude. Yeah, my call. All right, that's that's yeah. fair. Um, Either go for the win or trash whoever. It doesn't matter. Yeah. Uh, I will. Um, right, I would say that if you're coming after my bunnies, I have nothing but bunny cards, so you're going to get partisaned. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Let's um, start by crafting uh, false orders. Pity he Too can't late. use that. Yeah. Um, I don't know how much that does for him now. Then let's give you your um, warriors back. Post here. Or two points. Uh, the you? crown from Marcus's board moved. I don't particularly feel bad holding on to yours <gasps> for actions. Did he finally uh, realize? Maybe. Um, I'm going to spend. Crown gate might be uh, over, guys. Bird song. Uh, not going to do that yet. They may have fixed Let's... all of their errors retroactively. <clears throat> I'm so proud of them. And uh, swap me for a prop. Again. Yeah, but the double score didn't yeah, get corrected. No, it sort of got evened out because he thought he could here. craft. Yeah. Um... One, two, one, two. Oh. Well, he propagation burrowed, so that's good. Let's. Place a river folk warrior here. Uh, I'm going to battle you there. So if you want a partisans. So here's a question. Or do you have an ambush first? Is he about to go roll? bird dominance? Ooh, that roll. Hey, do you want a partisans? Uh, yeah, I will. All right. Point. And you uh, committed a fund for that, right? Uh, yes. We'll do commit the cat fund. He clears out that corner, pops a couple more recruits there. He could dom swap for the bird dominance and play it. All right, so you, um, you're down to just um, rabbit cards, right? Yep. All right, uh, I will attack again. Okay, go ahead. Ooh, he was just asking for an ambush there. And I'll commit a um, Gary. But he got it. So you lose another guy. Yep. I'll get two points. Um, and you flipped. Uh, <laughs> oh, my granite borrow. That's my favorite one. <laughs> <laughs> um. Now I will five recruits. That's not bad to hold a a bird dominance with. Four warriors. Well, actually, seven warriors total just available. <laughs> Pretty much. Um, Cats could stop it though. 
Yeah, but they have to stop themselves from winning to do where, so. Yeah, the best way it to keeps the game going. At this point. You know what I or, mean? Or the Cats could just win. Network, uh, right I don't know, you think? Same with, same with Moles. Moles so, could potentially just win. Uh, I think Moles have probably been policed hard. I mean, figure out the best way to hit them. Like, I think but Otters have two choices here. Good option. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think Otters have two choices here. They either... This is the best, but then how many Warriors do I bring? Uh, with me. Yeah, they're going for it. Releasing the cats. I was right gonna say. I have a total of five. One, two, three, four, five actions. Uh, I, I need two moves. Uh, and, and you gotta hit the keep. That leaves me with three battles. That's probably probably the best. Have more more battles. Yeah. I mean, I can assume he has two cards. He he might be able to save one. Might be able to save two. I think I just move all five and go. Go to town on battle actions. What do you, I think that's the way to do it. One, I almost two, wish he'd saved Propaganda Bureau just to remove a warrior from there. And then he wouldn't uh, get the recruit, battle. but he'd get to remove one. Uh, do, you, do you ambush? Uh, go ahead. All right. 2 1. Not the number he wants to see. Do you want to save? Yeah. Yeah, there it is. All right. They, they stay there. Um, Took the coins away from the cats, though. All right, go ahead. That's true. Although it doesn't matter. They didn't have the two bunny. You want to save? No. All right. Um, I will uh, <clears throat> battle again. It could happen. All right, go ahead. It's going to be tight, but he could do it. Ooh. Ooh. All right, so you lose two of those, those puppies. Yep. Two points for the otters, or one point for the otters. Yep, one point. Like, yeah. Oh, oh. Somebody does. Um, actually, I'll lose the keep instead of the. Yeah, uh, that's a better choice. Yeah. Oh, was that it? I thought right. he had one more fight. Um, and I have I have that appears to be it. No more actions. So that's my turn. Hmm. Well, I guess uh, Moles are going to tunnel in there. Uh, do you mind reducing your cost of your cards down to two? I'll buy so I can take out. The Don't do it. Something else. No, shoot uh, ground. Do not do it. Card. I mean, the question is, does yeah. he get him? Um. Uh. Whatever. I'll take it down to two. Oh no! It doesn't stop him from winning. I'll do it for you. Yeah, just because he needs to lose those sawmills. Otherwise, he's taking it. Oh, my <clears> goodness. <throat> Can moles win on cardboard removal? They need six points. There's okay. two points there. There is an undefended trade post in the corner, so they could sweep down for four. And then probably get a sway. So, um... Man, they are playing with fire right now. Gotta say though, that assault on the keep went better than I expected. That was pretty much okay. the best it could have been. So recruiting. Um shit. Crap, crap, crap. I don't think I can get to it actually. Oh. Hold on. Uh there's five here. Sorry, I find something inherently five, funny about like in the keep. people from sounding way off in the distance. Right, because there's no keep there now, so you can go there if you want. You dig and hit it. Oh, right, right, right. yeah, duh. Huh. Yeah, I don't know why I was thinking. Well, um, you were thinking that you saw the keep there, so you couldn't place the dig, right? Yeah, that's that's what I was thinking. Yeah, um, thanks for reminding me. All right, okay. so yeah, I'll use the bird card. Um, Better put out a tunnel, bud. Tunnel gate. <laughs> <laughs> and da, 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 da. still not grabbing the tunnel. 
an ambush uh, would be cash money right. right now. So yeah, so we're gonna battle the cats. All right, go ahead. Ambush, I presume, after that last onslaught. Okay, I'll take care of it. Do you have a uh, tunnel you want to token for that clearing yep. as well? Oh yeah, sure. <clears throat> sure, I suppose I'll play by the rules. If if you insist. All right, two points <laughs> for the moles. <laughs> and, and I'll use Marshall over here. And I don't have a second battle, but I need that for swaying, so that's fine. Interesting. The... He has the tunnel there for swaying. Yeah, I mean, he could. He doesn't need to leave the warrior there. I mean, if he's going to just win the game, he's got four clearings. He's only, he's only got one point. In sway, uh, what else? so he, he could... still needs three points. No, he only has two cards. With what actions? Marshall, deer, formal. Yeah, he doesn't have the action economy to finish this. Okay, so then my second battle. I uh, guess rabbit partisans three. means he can probably get that rabbit clearing workshop if he wanted to clear it out. I'll hit the cats right here. Um, there is an issue though because he. Took a brigadier battle, then he moved. Now he's doing another battle. He should be doing both battles at the same time. Oh, come on, two zero. Um, it's a good point. My understanding is that you have to yeah, execute no, you're, and resolve. You're right. I was trying to make sure he didn't. I will sway. Yeah, he moved the the moles down to the bunny and then moved one back. So, essentially, he'd split up his. One more point. His brigadier battles. Did he recruit unless, in addition to tunneling? No, he just um and because he could have battled with one of his two actions. That I don't know. He does have Marshall as a move. He didn't have Captain to battle with. He did two he way the last squire, so you're he either... def yeah, it could have been but he hasn't used he didn't use the brigadier. Right, so, so here's the thing. He either split up brigadier or he didn't take yeah, a second sure. fight very, uh, that he should have taken. Very intense game. Either way, he's messing up something. It has, hasn't it? Did he take a second battle? Just... No, that's what I'm saying. He he did two battles <laughs> with a move between them. So he's either missing a third I battle. See it myself, but or he cheated and split up Brigadier. Draw heart of the cards. Dig battle, Marshall move. There are no, there are no cards to buy from me, so I would probably yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I looked over really fast, so yeah. there's nothing. But yeah, Rodney's saying he said it, he did say he doesn't have another battle. Oh, of course. So I don't know what that means. I mean, I'm not, I'm not sad about it. He messed something up. I don't know what it is. All right, he's either missing an action or added an action that he um, shouldn't have had. Question for you guys. Sorry, I don't know this, but um, am I able to recruit on a spot that I do not have a rule over? Yep. Yes, as long as you have a roost. Okay. Let's uh, let's do. I love these tense final turns where everyone's trying to figure out how the heck to either keep the game going or to win. That was a pretty savage last turn. <laughs> yeah. I lost everything. Cats lost half of their stuff. Yeah. River folk went to town. Otters <laughs> Again, lost, with the moles burning down army. sawmills. <laughs> I would be surprised if cats have it. Hmm. Yeah, I'll, I'll throw down a two cards. I still have two, two sawmills. 
So we'll do this. Oh, one. he does have two sawmills. I missed one of them. This one. Um, and two different types of buildings and, uh, that take two wood. Got nothing to craft, so resolve the decree. Maybe craftables. Sure two in battle. Uh, yeah. One bunny. Yeah. Workshop. So. One bunny, one mouse. From both here. Then we'll Not just a great position. Take this hole. But there's a boot and a bag left. So that mouse could do work. Uh, and then we'll just go to battle on uh, cats if you guys have anything. Oof. Oh. Oh. Uh, no, go for it. I'm surprised that you don't want to battle the uh, otters there. I mean, maybe you will. Very or just, just first so that you don't lose as many warriors along the way. Um, well, right. I mean, I was... It's pretty close as it well, is. Well, yeah, the thing I'm, is he's I'm, getting I'm two so wood, behind. right? It's, I mean, I'm sure... I'm sure between the three of you guys, someone will be able to pull it off next turn if they didn't get attacked. So it's... Just a matter of if he yeah, if he has a crafting point and he builds a recruiter for three, that's four. He's close. Yeah, he's pretty close. I mean it makes sense. That's I don't think I can do it. If that's if that's any adds any clarification. I'm <laughs> thinking about it many different ways and I don't think I can get there. <laughs> he, well, yeah. Yeah, right, I mean go ahead. Anyways. Yeah, it is what it is. It's cardboard, it's cardboard. It's Oof. Oh, zero, zero. All right. Zero, zero. <laughs> Ouch. Wow. Well, that changes things now. <laughs> I think the table's too afraid of cats. Now. All right. Otters are next up. <laughs> That's fair. May the uh, dice be in your favor. I have no I have no ambush, as you can see, so. Right, right. Ooh, there's a roll. You got it. Good, good work, my friend. Oh, thank you. So that's uh, one point. Um, and then, yep, let's go to evening. I'll just get through. Go to the board. Marcus is the master of of getting the heat uh, off of him. I'll draw twice. Sometimes by whining, sometimes by quieting up. He is a master at it. Do you have it, Waterman? Were you lying through your teeth? I don't think I do have it. Um... And Marcus, I know you're going to watch this back. I say that with all the love in my heart. The roles there might have changed things a little bit. Which is still very little. You know, it is very little, yes. I have a small, Steve, unloving heart. Have used any of his bird cards? <laughs> uh, guy. Do the Grinch music. <laughs> yes. I think he one, right? Yeah. Um, early on, I think. This most recent time I used a uh, fox card. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah. yeah, it was like for the two one you used a fox, I think. And then yeah, I don't there think was, you used anything after that. There was a two-two battle somewhere else where I, I used a bird card to rescue him, but that was that was a, many turns ago, many moons ago. I like this little effigy for the keep on, Waterman I made. It was like a Corvid planner. I was like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> well, what would have been about, is if the Hiri had hit you here instead of taking the point, you would not have easily been able to move the wood. If it was at three zero, you would have had nothing there. So would have been interesting. Yeah, I, I don't think that changes too too much for me, in all honesty. Just because I not, I don't have. Uh, Unfortunately, he has to use one of his actions to move in order to build. Too, too many. Yeah. Which is okay is if he's rude? also going to get a point from it, but just from like battling or well, something. He can move into that. He can move into that mouse clearing, take the roost, and build. Yeah, I guess all that I can really do with my turn sadly is uh overwork the sawmill Ooh, overwork gonna build a recruiter then maybe recruit and as well and build a recruiter here for three points rodney i thought about that it was a real gamble for cats if if the field hospital had worked and kept otters off cats would have maybe have been in a winning position here but at the same time you're right it did probably have it like it did hand the game to the moles in a way 
I mean, you definitely have it on your next turn. Yeah. Yeah. I so, just don't think you think Marcus has it? The thing, with, the thing with the mole. Probably. Is that they are out of swaying squires. And I don't know how he doesn't get three points. Nobles. So they can only sway lords. Yeah. And they don't have enough cards. And the only way they can get other cards is if I were to draw a card. Uh, um, so okay. as long as I don't do that, they actually can't sway a lord. I got it. Um, yeah, he's right. Unless, unless I'm missing Fortunately. something. Nope, they only have rabbit partisans. Yeah, so they actually, they can't do the huge point jump this game. Another idea is that they could um, maybe build and then craft something. So like the rabbit clearings, because coins are still available, is still pretty vulnerable. Um, oh, that makes sense. Mm. Yeah. You'd have to have the exact right three cards to do that. He would. It would be true RNG. Or um, yeah, but uh, you know that's assuming that they have they have coins. Um, well, we'll leave it. We'll leave it to chance. the heart of the cards, as you so poetically put it, Competus. Huh. I'm gonna draw two cards and end the turn. I mean, otherwise, otherwise you definitely have it on your turn. Uh, so what do otters do? Because otters can't win. Let's move everything back. But otters could maybe wipe moles, so, but then cats just win. How much is this? So what do they do? Uh, looks like it's 10 in total. It's not bad. Uh, <laughs> That's a lot, lot of troops. Let's see, it's, it's not enough to win, unfortunately. No, it's not quite. Yeah, it's not quite enough to go in on this turn, unfortunately, which means that my best bet is trying to stop um, Marcus, I think. Uh, well, no, the I cats mean, are winning on their turn, too. You got to try yeah, to win your turn. No, no. turn. I, I was looking at the cats, and I immediately said Marcus. I mean, my best my best bet is actually to try and stop Waterman. Um, but that's actually like pretty hard to do. Uh, Birds will have a, uh, a turn as well to stop the cats. Yeah, I think I have the chance to stop the moles though. I think Waterman actually has a point there. I think you play the turn order a little bit, hurt moles a tiny bit, and then maybe go after cats bad, with the rest but... of your actions. Hmm. How does? And you don't have to hit the moles as like hard as you need to hit the cats. Yeah, just like remove a tunnel. Very difficult for us to stop because, like, maybe he like he, he crafts. Um... Me crafts to the win, right? Because I don't, I, I don't see a way for him to get uh, a. I mean, if I have if I have coins, I think it's GG. But yeah. I can tell you, I don't have coins. <laughs> yeah. So. If you would have coins, it would be GG. Otherwise, can you clean up enough cardboard? I mean, I definitely have cardboard sitting out there. Um, you know, there. Maybe oh, who said Waterman? Water Did I say Waterman? And show up my defenses, and then just see how it plays out. Um, no, that was uh, a terrible idea. Either. Shoe Crown. Let the, uh, <laughs> I missed it. Do what they can. Waterman. The cats, to an extent. Uh, uh, Marcus couldn't sway Banker because he was technically out of crowns, and he did remove his cheaty crown. Also, probably the only turn that I have to actually false orders. So crown gate was resolved. We think. Right. I mean, I would, I would say you should probably try to take out one of those double building slot clearings for the cats. I mean, um, that's just because that's I mean, points for you, right? I mean, if you remove something, you remove the sawmill. Yeah, like which ones do I? Like everyone knows that. Take out. That one, maybe. No. Uh, you go for the sawmill. North Mouse. I'll sort of this guy and then just take out my tunnel. That's also an option. That's true, but like that seems weak. Honestly, I'm less afraid of you than I am. I mean, can we can we keep? <clears throat> is is it possible for us to keep Waterman from scoring two points? <laughs> <He's doing it. laughs> It all depends on. <laughs> Is this pronunciation gate? The, the cheap cardboard. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> yeah. It's Watergate. Uh, <laughs> I was trying not to make that joke, but. <laughs> seems like an important. Joke. Okay. Well, I made it. You I'll, made I'll it. do it. You'll do it. <laughs> uh, come full circle. I can't not hear it. I can't not hear it anymore. I mean, we are officially Watergate now. If, 
if I were to do trade posts, I have. If you drew, two, if you drew coins, that's three points, right? These two here. If I had coins, right? Um, this is six. This is the most that I can get. As these are the doubles that I. Can, these are trade posts that I can get out, right? So I get six points. So I could potentially be up to uh, twenty-five. Um, and then if I, I mean, if I were to draw like, if I were to draw coins. And then if I were to draw a sword, oh no, but I don't. I, the thing is, is like for coins, I would have to uh, put three in, right? Yeah, you're you're short. Yeah, I'm, I'm. That's the thing is, I'm just short uh, at this at this point. So even if 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 I were to go, if if I was like, you know, if I had one more turn, maybe. But at this point, we're just looking at stopping stopping Marcus. Um, not Marcus. Sorry, I, I said that again. Stopping Waterman, if possible. I don't know if it's possible though. I don't. I really don't think like. He could just congregate here, get a point, and then he has to be able to find a point on, of cardboard somewhere else, right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, yeah, pretty, he's, he's got it. You're just he's... about as good just trying to draw stuff because you have the, you know, propaganda bureau, false orders. You can, I don't see a surprise win for birds. I don't know. Flip, flip potato. My eerie here and Maybe with out. Commander cleaning up cardboard or something. I mean, a good, a decent false order. Or a bunch of craftables. I take out a sawmill. What do they have? Two four, a sword. They have two okay, they have they have a sword. Uh, and a mouse. Too many guys. They don't have a they don't have and a coin. One point from blowing up one cardboard. Yeah, yeah. there's there's no stopping. But them. all they have is a sword and a bag. That's three oh, points. I, I think unfortunately I think it's a game. Twenty five. Making at this point. Uh, I yeah. just don't see I it mean, for Yuri. Three. I think that if I like, it's possible that I could set it up just for you to win, but that seems lousy. <laughs> you know what I mean? So Waterman, Waterman yeah. probably. Like, I think Waterman like deserves uh, the W. I can't not hear it. I, would, I can to try and stop it because I think that he has pretty much a surefire win, and I'll, I'll do what I can to stop it. And I think the way that I, I, I don't know, birds actually do have a path. Orders this here, and that at least puts all of his cats into one place, and it gives me it's a, such a long shot for them. To try and hit that. They've got a full hand uh, though. Yeah. So okay. and give them credit; they have a full yeah. hand. Um, so I'll go ahead and use my. Got to get through Mo's turn, though. To do that piece. Um, oh yeah. And that's gonna be two warriors. That's wrong. That's yeah. wrong. Yeah, thank you. To... And then... The other thing is, Competus has to see it too okay. if he does have it, and Competus has True. not been an overly aggressive player this game, and that would be an aggressive finish. I will. And Rodney's pointing out that the birds can rule the pass, which is a great point. Yeah, yeah. That's what I'm saying. That Seeing that would be aggressive. And I don't know that Competus has shown a play style that's conducive to seeing that. I will. I want to go to war is what I want to do. Yeah, you're going to war in the wrong place, buddy. I don't know why you're doing it there. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I'll hit. I'll um, give uh, the Erie their cardboard back. Thank you. They called the wood cardboard. Nice one there. I agree, Lord of the Board. Two points. I think, I think Mark is staying quiet for a reason. Uh, I feel like I've been staring at this board for like a little too long because I did not even think about that at all that's such a good move <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah um so i figured clean up the free cardboard i mean i'm leaving i'm leaving it out here but i think that uh i mean marcus it's a free point for marcus if he can get to it before anybody else eh. it's good at it's least he's doing point. maybe i'll place the guy there and defend it right at the end it's at least he's doing clean up um i will place Trading an undefended cardboard for a defended Marcus, cardboard is is hurting Marcus. Warriors, Mar uh, in a way. Marcus, you don't like rule anything, so I, I can't. I don't think I can even give you your warriors back. <laughs> yeah, um, you're right. Sorry, you broke a promise. <laughs> promise broken. Promise for, gate. Um, recruits. recruits. Yeah. I like the idea. Place them here. And I will 
anymore. Uh, it does get years. spent, right? Not just committed. Uh, what's that? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Yep. You get him back. There you go. Thank you. Um, I will do. I'll do one more of mine and put them here, and then I will move with. Oh no no no! With I need I need to have five if I want to move them, because otherwise I I just um tie with you. I'll move them here, and then I'll do a battle. Do you ambush? Uh, go ahead. Wow, Ooh. good roll. Okie dokie. I'll get a point. And then I will... Oh man, I didn't think that was going to go that well. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I, I committed one of those, I'm pretty sure, for that battle. And so I think I only have one more left. Uh, one more battle. I got to get better at making sure I commit those on turn. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hit the workshop as well. All right. I'll, I'll just take the point for it, and that's 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 my turn. Um, I'll jack everything up to four. Okay, okay. that's sensible at least. I think I might have this. We'll see. Um, I'm gonna buy your mercenaries. All right, he's buying mercenaries, yeah. guys. <laughs> Easy points, people. Smack that one way down there. Yep. Nice. Ooh. And oh, oh man. Okay. He's got three battles. We'll see. All right. No sway. Oh, Maybe a crafting. Bro. He's got to build to craft. Yeah, that's possible. Since he's not swaying. Yeah, how do I do this? Okay. <clears throat> Dig, build, craft. I recruit. And this is just kind of insurance in case Waterman drew the improbable 12th ambush card. <laughs> uh, all right, and then I'll dig. The midnight ambush. Yeah. He drew coffin makers again. That's funny. Okay. You want to move a tunnel there? Yep. I got it. All right. All right. He's got partisans. So, He's got the roost. Um, but we're at two points. Yeah, so my first action is uh, my first minister action is going to be a the captain battling here. Ambush. Go ahead. Three, one. Okay. All right. Then I'm going to use Marshall. Yep. There it is. Um, and then Brigadier battle that. I got nothing. There it is. Does uh, Erie have an ambush? That. Ooh, good. That, uh, uh, I have an ambush for what it's worth, but you still get the extra point or no? No. Yeah. No. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Use the, the ambush. ambush. He kills your guys there, right? Or he kills my guys. Use... <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. It's the one he bought from Otters. <laughs> it's the one I bought from Otters. <laughs> <laughs> you get a point for that, too. Yeah. You get a point. Oh. Shit. Dude, oh. I told you fine for me. Pays off. <laughs> Is Competus gonna pull it off? Wait, you had the midnight ambush? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. Let's see. Marcus got nothing. So I still have formal but unless yeah, he's got a crafting in his hand for me. Oh, 
captain, marshal, brigadier, formal. I can use this. How good is that? Build a building. And then he crafts the boot. Uh, he just said he doesn't have it. Does, there's no way. Draw my two cards and that's it. Oh, Dang, yeah. Well played, sir. Oh, good work, Competus. How that glorious is bit. that? I mean, it was, I mean, that gives, that gives the game to Waterman, but it was, it was a good. Uh, yeah, a good it does. Come on, Competus, pull it off. Tell me you have it. Okay, so I don't know what these cards actually are. Hold on. Yeah. You got this tunnel ones down here too. I don't know if. I think I drew too many. Hold on. Should only have. Uh, even with the market. I was. Two, three, four. He just has to make three points on top of a build. Cards. So I guess I drew. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. It doesn't matter. If he has a craft, All right. well, he could maybe pull it off. Let's see. Can't craft any of these cards. <sighs> no, Oops. don't say that. <laughs> Let's see. That's not what we wanted to hear. It's not what we wanted to hear. Yeah, unfortunately, <clears throat> I, I did try to stop water man but like i really don't think there's any way to stop him from getting two points like he gets one for the no. pass no he's he's got it unless yeah, unless computers pulls yeah. something out of his butt here yeah i mean <laughs> you'd have to, like it would you would have to um somehow i don't know you, I, it's just not possible like he has a good just, continue to hear i mean just just go for maximum points computer yeah, right and, no yeah, yeah. Because you're not going to stop One, two, them. Two, three, four, five. Right. Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, all I got is mouse. So, mm, it's very bad. <sighs> Man, if he just had a crafting, yeah. I don't see it without the crafting. I'll just do. Uh, he can get so close, a... though. Our best bet, if we're trying to stop him from getting a point, is like him rolling double zeros and you just having something to defend. So like probably recruiting a guy there is not bad. And then maybe like mm -hmm. I don't know, yeah. moving. A guy, I don't know. Um, no, nah, dude, it's it's way too easy. He just battles the tunnel it's a, it's here. A and, I think Waterman just, has it. No, nah, yeah, he has it. Battles yeah. the tunnel. And it's game over. Mm -hmm. uh, Marcus, uh, if he didn't have that ambush, you had the uh, you had the point there. Let's see, well, I did. Yeah, you daylight. It was the one I was. It was the one I was afraid of. I held it to the yeah. end because I was like, ah, I yeah. think it might. Would a double build make sense? This is when, no, this is when he's at the point on his score track where we get the same number of I points. Of It'd be four or four. I just. Uh, oh, know, that's so awkward. Uh, it's for this exact reason. It always comes up right at this moment. I'm, I'm cool with it. I think I might have had a chance next turn, but I couldn't have done it last turn. Mouse partisans, what does that get? Mm -hmm. Cats. Cats on the mountain map, man. <laughs> I was thinking yeah. about it. I was thinking about it. I thought I thought um, moles, uh, cats, eerie, lizards, they're all good for river folk. Uh, all good for river folk. I, no, it's good you, it was good you picked river folk. I, I really wanted to play them. It sucks being uh, last in draft order because yeah. next level otters doesn't win. Ooh, I'd, I'd love to play cats. Ooh, I'd love to play otters, but uh, I know I'm not going to get them. <laughs> yeah, you, I mean, you shouldn't, you shouldn't feel bad, dude. You uh, like you were one ambush away from winning. Like you played a really solid, um, really solid moles. Uh, no, I know it's it's yeah. fine. Solid moles, but with a dodgy turn, so yeah, yeah. There's some justice to him. Uh, I just throw getting ambushed there, but I don't know if there'll be much. Um, if you want to, I mean, if you can try to contest the pass and make it things interesting, you could yeah, you can go sure. in there, battle my battle my tunnel, and yeah, your your best bet is trying to con uh, contest the pass. It's just um, getting your guys there, fighting, you know. Uh, but he literally have, can just he literally can have, move anywhere and just build twice uh yeah. to get a um 
to get yeah. a, a workshop out and you can move you can move uh, you can move the three there and then you rule and then you can move um another three there and then you rule and then you could fight him there and it makes him hard. he has to actually he has to commit to try to to try to get that extra point it's probably the best that we can do to make it difficult for him to win. Nah, dude, and just just you finish your turn. It, it's it's GG. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. He's got so many options to win. Lord of the board, we're we've been taking a hands off approach to rules well, this entire tournament. For, uh, to some extent. Partially because we didn't intend to stream every game. That just sort of accidentally happened. Right. Uh, we're probably going to do moderation for I'll the final just, yeah, game. I don't, know. I don't know. It depends on if I can get people so you could just hit here, to moderate hit here, with me. Get the pass. Here, That's true, but like he needs he, need, he needs two points, and like and he has limited actions, and he only has two cards. So like, if we don't give, if we make sure that he doesn't get the free pass, then he has to actually roll for the other places. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. and like, yeah. That's hey, season, and you do have the you do have the recruiting that you could put one of your warriors there, and then it's not necessarily a free point. He has to actually roll to get it, and then you can move two of those here and attack that. And if you turmoil, it doesn't matter because you weren't winning anyway this turn, uh -huh. right? Right. So, right. and it's it's the one thing that might extend it a turn. Uh -huh. Fugless, Mo Marcus took a turn where he either he either took yeah. an extra battle action he didn't have, or he split up Bridget and then didn't okay, use his second Bridget battle for now. So he did something okay. fudgy, uh, no matter what. Yeah, it's not bad. You put the one there for the defense. You move two here, um, and that means that you. Have Although to I'd like to see the table not actually, taking the turn. Yeah, you can't because you you rule, uh, and you only have the one move action anyway. So yeah, you could move the one there for the defense. Right. Yeah. Or put the one there for the defense. I think it's interesting that they're move choosing the there, to try to prolong the game. I'm actually really proud of that because I mean, so many times. But it's players in this likely. situation would just kamikaze for a couple it's, it's points that make no difference the two cards but yeah. actually trying to play the rng yeah. and extend I'm the game i really if like if i um don't put this guy here um no you can be uh hey right, i got no, the building you're right, there you're right you're right you can't yeah um uh, you, cyber kills waterman <laughs> has not done anything just, uh, erroneous as far as i caught recruit. and I, I think it's fine like this i'm just gonna smack yeah. uh I'm just going to smack this one. Yeah. Uh, do you have any ambushes, Waterman? Uh, no, go ahead. Or uh, Actually, sorry. I. That, let's see. That was my recruit. I guess I just have a move to which I'll just... Uh, hmm. Let's see. Probably just take some dudes back to here and defend. So, um, I, I think... I, I think it's still worthwhile to, um, or you know, I'm not trying. I'm not trying to play your turn, but like, I think right. like even moving the four there and controlling the pass is the more important aspect because he doesn't have to do anything to win that. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, yeah. Eh, I don't know. Never mind. It, it's up. It, you, uh, you go ahead and play your turn. I, I was just thinking out loud. I do actually agree with that reasoning. Let's bring these two here. Uh, that is a, yep, blue move. And then on this battle, so uh, let's do my mouse battle first right here for you, Waterman. All right, go ahead. Two, two, two. two. All right, so we both lose two. Uh, and then I'll run it back. One, one. One, oh, come on. <laughs> all right. Um, <clears throat> I think that's yeah, all the mouse fights, isn't it? I guess. Yeah. Uh, I didn't call on the first one. Oh, mouse partisans would have made all the difference. One, I guess I'll do it. I only have mouse in my hand, so. Um, just oh, he just denied thing. himself a point. So oh. would have been nice at first, but no, I didn't call it. It's all good. Um, rabbit, one more. All uh, right, go ahead. Zero, Oof. zero. <laughs> there. If that's not the way to win, to end the game. All right. Let's. Uh, All right, Waterman, wrap this up. Um, and then, yeah, I'll just draw. Call it. Mm. 
Um, all right. Hmm. Um, it was not undefended when he started the fight, Rodney. I only need the one wood, I think. Yeah. Okay. You're actually kind of closer to winning than I thought. Um, after mm -hmm. you scored up everything. Birdsong. But thank you yeah, for the praise. If I had drawn more uh, crafting stuff, it would have been close. But... Yeah. It's funny, I have bags in my hand ready to craft, but you guys <laughs> destroyed my workshop over here, hey, sadly. Don't, contribute. don't say you guys. I did that by myself. That's okay. true. Everything <laughs> <laughs> I could to try and stop you. <laughs> right? All right. Um, I'm gonna. He just needs two points. He just gotta build something. Uh, I'm gonna Surely take a march and move these three guys over here. And then I'm gonna build a workshop for, for nothing. For nothing. And then I'm gonna build for two points. Okay. Uh, workshop. For one wood for two points. Should and win the that's game. 30. Good game, dude. Good game. Congratulations wow. to Waterman. Moving on to the finals. Yeah, it was fun. Uh, couldn't, been... have, couldn't have been closer on that uh, last duchy turn, for real. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Do you think three. it would have changed anything if the Eerie had hit this hard? All right, John, I'm going to switch to the uh, Discord chat. I probably wouldn't have. Probably. I had a meme play in my back pocket that would have made everyone super mad, but I would have just bought mercenaries and then built here instead. Oh, yeah. Uh, if anything yeah. would have happened. Good point. Good point. That's a great idea. <laughs> oh, man. That would have been pretty cool. Yeah, I just that seemed a little too like meme -y, but <laughs> <laughs> you had multiple ways. I, I, yeah, I didn't. I didn't really think we had a way of stopping you after you got to that threshold. Good, good work, dude. Um, yeah, it was it was down to the wire though. I was so certain the moles just had all those crafted improvements going on. I was like, oh man, it's gonna be so tough to man whittle them on, down. The, I was on police duty all game. Yeah, those are some <laughs> super police otters. Super police otters. <laughs> Beating down everybody. Well, great game, everyone. That was a terrific watch. Yeah. Thank it was you. a lot of fun. Was, yeah, that was good. All right. Congratulations to Waterman for winning. Thank you, everyone, for playing. It has been a pleasure having you in the tournament. Thank you. GG, really Waterman. Cool. Good luck in your next game. I Thanks, guys. GG. Bye, everyone. Have a good one, y'all. Later. Good night. Yeah, good night, man. Congratulations. Oh, thanks, Competus. Good game, man. Yeah, good game. Thank you. And I want to thank BotBot Bot for co-commentating with me. He cannot hear me at this moment, but I'm saying that. And I want to thank everyone for watching. We have another one of these tomorrow afternoon at, I believe, 1 EST PM. And then another one on Sunday at 12 PM EST at noon, effectively. And then the fourth one will be on the 27th, time to be determined. Uh, we have an exciting slate of commentators for each of those. Uh, we have uh, Waterman and Murder, She Root on one of them. We have Fuglas and Lily. We have uh, Marcus and um, Billy. And then it's looking like we might get somebody from Leader for the final. So stay tuned for that. But uh, thanks everyone for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.